This is strictly medieval Minecraft. Imagine playing old school RuneScape, but in Minecraft. Want to equip a diamond axe? Nope. You gotta at least be level 35 in woodcutting. This hands down has got to be one of the most best mod packs out there, and it's super underrated. There's tons of weapons, armor sets, and most of all, the most deadliest bosses to fight. And don't forget to subscribe and like the video if you enjoy it. So let's dive in and immerse ourselves as we journey through 100 days of strictly medieval Minecraft. Alrighty, folks, we're back again for another 100 days journey. You thought things would get old? Oh, heck no. God, no. So there's a bunch of origins. Uh, I know that Orange Juice has made a bunch of freaking custom ones, but we're going to play as the mighty old human Sir Is Kevin. And so from what I'm knowing of this mod pack is that there is a lot of stuff to do in here. Oh, my God. What is this? Jesus. Push J. Okay, here we go. God, this village is huge. Okay, yeah, there is a lot of stuff that we have to do in starting of the, the basics of playing this mod pack. A, there is a thing to level up your, like, you know, your your stuff, like wood cutting, mining, and stuff like that. And it also has a lock. So, uh, if you want to equip a iron sword, you need to increase your combat level. So, things are going to take a little bit while to increase everything in order to start equipping better stuff. But, in order to do any of that stuff, we have, there's also paragliders, so you can increase your HP, your stamina. Um, and there is a massive freaking massive skill tree which is absolutely insane so we're gonna go ahead with the quest book and it looks like there's my first swim meet there's parkour you can get some agility stuff to go we can kill a bunch of creepers get a heart container so if we stay up at night it seems like if we kill a bunch of stuff at night we can get some additional spirit orbs and we need to find a uh the statue thingy majiggy but got our nice first little village here Pumpkin pies. I'll take some pumpkin pies. Can I take this one too? <gasps> Look at all that food. Oh, looter. Look at that. Whoa, dormant eye. It's a charm. Look at that. It's connected to the location beyond your space and time. You can awaken the eye if you wish or is to drawing attention of someone or something. Ooh. We get a horse flute. First spawn bag. Gives us some oak logs, some apples, and some torches. Tons of bread. Look at that. 50 bread now. So it's, here's what I'm thinking we're going to do, all right? We're going to start off by leveling up some mining, some wood cutting. Oh my god, there's already a iron pickaxe and stuff like that. That's pretty cool. I got to level up first. So first things first, we can level up combat by killing some sheep like this. Let's put that down. So we can't use other tools like stone tools. So in order to use a stone shovel, we need to dig dirt with a wooden shovel. So orange juice has added vein mining. So if I click this button and then chop all this down, our wood cutting level goes up substantially. Pushing alt, you can see that my wood cutting is level seven. And I think it's level 10. I think it's level 10 for stone, which isn't too bad. Air level 10, we should be able to use a stone. But the next part to this is actually mining. So mining is the more difficult part. Uh, Because honestly, I will, from what I was told is that create mod is your best friend in this pack. You definitely want to get into create mod mining stuff. So finding those ores early game with an iron pick is crazy good. So we're going to try to find that. Don't mind if I mine this coal right here. Stone age, look at that. Ow. <laughs> Oh, amazing. But yeah, basically, it kind of reminds me a lot of like RuneScape. You know, like old school RuneScape, you know, before you can equip certain materials. and Oh, we already hit water. That's not a good sign. Before you can start like using different materials, you have to level up your wood cutting, level up your mining. Oh, oh, see, this is the stuff right here. This is what we want. Actually, this shield is actually pretty sweet. Not even a lie. What is that? Easter egg? What does that do? Oh, I just ate it. Whatever that was. <laughs> there we go. Whoa! Is there a fallen chaos knight already, dude? Okay, hang on, hang on, hang on. I got a roll ability, so let's try that. Oh, God. I'm gonna try to... Oh, boys. Oh, this is not a good idea, actually. Actually, wait a second. I might have a good idea, but I don't have another pickaxe, do I? Here's what I got. What if I punch down, then I can play peekaboo with this guy? Yeah, here we go. Look at that. Yeah. Come back. Right here, right here. Come on, one last hit for me. Yeah. That was some good chaos there. Oh, that's a wreath. Okay. Woo. Damn, dude. Okay. Uh-huh. Come on. Something. What is that thing? I want to sleep. Freaking wreath jumped on my butt, dude. What the heck? 
Oh no, there's monsters. And then we can see if we can wield a uh, stone sword. Can we wield this? Yes, we can. Okay. Okay. What the? F what the? F huh? What? Okay, 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 go, 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 go. Okay, we got it. Now that's something, I guess. All right, so I think I might make myself a little base camp in here for now. All right, I, I hear you. I don't understand that guy. What the heck? Yeah, I forgot there's combat rolls. Uh-huh. Yes, nerd. Whoa, almost level 15 combat already. Damn, okay. Don't pickaxe. What a wonderful day one. I completed so many freaking quests in the meantime as well. More stamina. All right, well, that's a cute little bridge over there. Oh, here we go. Nice little cave. Oh, uh, yeah. Gobber lucky blocks. Yeah, yeah. I love gobber. Let's go mining a bit. All right, there we go. All right, so we should be able to use the stone pickaxe now. Okay, the one thing that I have to figure out is what kind of class that I want to do. want to be like an ultimate tank. Yeah, Um, you can buy skill points. I don't know if like you can get them by killing stuff. Arrow of swiftness. Seems like we can just start digging down here. Copper, let's go. Hang on, I'm just going to vein mine all this. What we're trying to get is iron. And I think to wield an iron pickaxe is mining level 15. So they are, I, this is my second attempt, guys. I will admit, I, I am at fault at something. This is my second attempt. I only made it till day six. I chose an origin that was didn't have many uh, hearts. I kept dying a lot. Oh, damn. That's not, that's really sucky. I can't go in there. So here we are. Hopefully there's some iron and stuff on the walls for this. Okay, let's uh, let's have a look around. Oh, here we go. We got some iron. That's so good. And it's three pieces exactly, so I can make like a furnace and stuff. Well, we got a broken. Oh, dude, there's no way they're socketing in here, dude. <gasps> da -da. Dude, imagine like with like ultimate armor sets that you can make. Oh my god, and you got a skill tree. I don't know about you guys, but I have a simple brain. And, you know, packs like Exploria uh, were really good for me because minerals and materials explore the lands, bring you back, and expand your camp. Like this is literally like the simplicity of like RuneScape. Oh! Did you guys see all that XP? Oh my god. Oh, now it's just a wine bottle. There you go. Now we got night vision for a couple seconds. Oh. Oh my god. A rare pickaxe. I will take that. What is this? Magic mirror. We got two of them. Two magic mirrors. We got a warp impact book. What the frip? Oh, I did not see that coming. Holy shit. Bullshit. There we go. More lead ore. Easy mining levels. Whoa. What is that? Lumberjack zombie. Hello. All right. Hey, look at that. Zinc. That's the good stuff. Resilient grave metal. Can I wear that? Oh, God. No. Oh, God. It's, oh, iron. Let's go. It's definitely worth going to a mine shaft if you guys are starting out in this, in this pack. Cow. Animal fat cow carcass oh yeah and then you need a butcher knife or something like that to like get the leather from them and stuff like that god damn this is crazy what is this i don't even want to know what's in there oh free leather there we go never mind got a hunter's belt as well you feel like oh that's not fun that's not fun all right i'm gonna go right to sleep you know what i'm, I'm, I'm sleeping right on the floor if you feel like something is chasing you i'm going to bed is it this house yes okay so let's mark it on the map where are we Who's playing that disc? A campfire. Yeah, you see? Just like that. Place it on top. And now you get farmer's delight. And now you can start cooking some of the best foods in the game. Look at that. Everything is coming into place. And then I'm going to put them against this wall. We need string to make the backpack. Uncommon or or ornamented sword with looting. We get a thousand combat. And one thing, we get an egg as my reward. All right, let's see. Whoa. We can iron axe which i what level do you have to be for oh my god I can't, what the heck what level is my wood cutting uh, wood cutting is level 10 so i need to make a stone one and level up the wood cutting so i can equip that one bye bye house now we can equip this thing pow <laughs> what house are you talking about you know the one down the street that's right across your house that makes it look like poop yeah well it looks like dog water shovel i think wooden shovels can't really vein mine because of the durability now we're at excavation level 18, and now we can finally use this. 
iron chest plate. Oh, you need endurance 15 for this? Okay. So hopefully I don't get some crazy shit that's out here. I just need spiders. Give me normal Minecraft vanilla mobs. They keep shooting each other though. There we are. Doesn't work. I'll go like this. There we go. No, my act, my sword's gonna break. I think I might go back to that mine shaft. I am so sure there is like, uh, I am so sure there was like cobwebs and stuff in there. Okay, so whatever red marks that stay on the map, obviously are spiders. Oh, there's a place here that might, there, there's an old ruined place that might have some webs in it, like a jungle looking thing actually. This thing up here, it has a jungle temple or something. It was the one from like better Minecraft and um. The, 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 the other pack I just played from Fantasy Minecraft. There's a lot of cobwebs in there and spiders on its own. Yeah, it's like a jungle temple, but like a wood one. This is trippy. Yeah, there's a lot of mobs down there. I hope there's spawners. Spawners would be really cool. Creeper so far. This is stairs. Yep. Holy creepers, dude. Oh my god. Okay, yeah, no. Yeah, no, we're, we're out. We're out. We're out like a light. Okay. Well, uh, we're not doing that. That's wicked. All right, let's grab the cobwebs. Yeah, baby. Yeah. Uh, punch two. Not bad. Amethyst shards. Not too shabby. Whoa, what are those trees? Those things are pretty sweet. Oh, it's create. Look at that. Look, main mine. Here we go. Craft the backpack. And then with the copper that we have, you take the backpack, you surround it, but then you get a copper backpack, which increases the slots. And then you put it here, right? Okay. Not too shabby. Uh, we can do boots. Traveler boots. Um, Because you never know when... Oh my god, it's an epic one. Extended. Ah, damn. Okay, cool. Let's go right here. Yeah, what I might do is... Uh, oh, here we go. We got some lead. Ow. We got a... Uh, here we go. This experience and chance of the undead treasure seeker increases the chance of finding special items Ooh, i will go with that cave looks like and silver ore I mind if i do i'm gonna take that copper kind of gives you like goo and stuff like that to like sustain yourself spider over there oh yeah i hear you oh. <laughs> okay that's limestone wait oh Boom. Like, what level is my mining at? Level 32 in mining. God. Oh, what is that? Ooh. Oh, yeah, I saw that. It was at the Better Minecraft. What you do is you right click and it gives you XP, I think. Yeah. Straddle Jump 1, an enchantment book that was just randomly inside of that clay pot. Vein mine that. Get all the jade. And there's some gold ore and such just underneath. This is all... Oh, that's infected. Yeah, you don't want to mine that. Oh, gobber! Damn. Spawn something that you... Okay. That is a pot crab. Uh, ooh, trader. I will do that. I will also do this. Yeah, you, don't, you got anything else for me, do you? No way. Yeah, that's more infected diamond. Mine that. What is this? I can't mine that. Stella Arcanum. Boom. Hit me again, hit me again. Again, 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 again. Come on, come on. There we go, 15, let's go, dude. That should be able to get us our iron armor, I think. Whoa. That goes deep, deep. There's a diamond right down there. I'm gonna grab that. Unless it's an infected one. Oh yeah, that's the one thing about going deeper. Ooh, that's more infected. Diamonds, arcane. Yeah, let's grab that. That is a zombie brute. That is a big badonker guy. We're gonna go this way. <laughs> or Jade. Oh, that's sick. Baby, look at that. Boof! Okay, now it's an amethyst cave. That's it. Aquamarine. See this mud and cooked chicken. Hell yeah. Probably a little bit better in saturation. Hello, Zom Zom. Is it if it's just you, you're okay. Haha, <laughs> we're like right at the house. That's hilarious. Okay, that is that is pretty neat, not gonna lie. But I want to keep the jades. What can we do with the jade stuff? So jade. Ooh, sweet mama! We need endurance level 75 though. Holy jumping. How do you do this? A smithing table. Oh, you need a gilded netherite chest plate with a jade core and jade alloy. We have like jade stuff here. No, jade samurai. Ah, here it is. This is the stuff we need. Oh boy. Okay. I mean that 
That, I mean, this looks pretty sick though. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie. Wear the iron armor now. We're gonna we're gonna make some of that jade armor, then. dude. That looks sick. What the heck? A little cap, right? A little cap. A legendary cap on top of that. Not too shabby. Look at that. Eight max HP. God damn. All right. Kill ten zombies. We got a spirit orb, which we're gonna use right away. We're gonna need that. Basic storage. We got stone axe and another one of these, and then another nature bag. Pantalones. It's a skirt. The common one, unfortunately. And then uh, a pair of boots. Another common pair of boots. But you know what? We're already pretty geared out. So we got a nature bag. One, two, three. Wow. Just a bunch of junk chest stuff over here. But Oh, wait. We can put bundles in here? Wait, we have a bundle. Wait, how do you use, like, bundle? God damn. So we can put... We have two in here. Look at that. Because uh, I don't want to run into that like storage problem that we usually do in like our other previous videos. We always have a bad habit of that. So we're going to put all our gems and... Oh, it's six. They changed it. It's six spirit orbs now. There you go. We got an iron backpack. It's fine. I can do that. No worries. So now gold backpack. Oh my God. That's so much space. I love it. Okay, maybe sophisticated backpacks are a lot better than uh, <laughs> the other backpacks mods out there but i'm not I'm not sure don't take my word for it okay what are you guys doing man no i didn't i didn't did i piss them off there's no way i just pissed them off didn't i punch bread there punch bread there there we go okay so i feel like we can go explore the world now and see if we can find some dungeons so what i can do is i can do crafted might as well go with like a a tank or something yeah okay let's do that yeah let's go with this we have one more Oh, got some over there. It's also a cargo ship. That thing is filled with redstone, if I remember. It's a redstone building. Are you slime? Yes. I am slime. Not too shabby. All right, what do you got up here? Oh, nice. Oh, a waystone. Name tag and a saddle. Oh, I don't know if I want to use this uh, a name tag, but definitely going to keep this waystone. Waystones are very useful, man. The big airship. Oh, wait, is that a pillar? Oh! Oh, okay, I thought it was like a Taurus or something. Okay, that is a... Oh, wow. Do I have any arrows? No, I don't, eh? Okay, 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 okay. Didn't realize that it... Holy shit! I don't know if I'm going to be able to kill that guy. Kill this guy with a backpack real quick. Okay, let's try to kill this. I don't know. Hold. <laughs> yeah, that's right. You don't mess with me, man. All right, there's two chests. Holy shit. Jeez. What are these guys doing with that kind of loot just sitting around like that? What the flip? This is insane. Uh, what do you trade? You trade two diamonds for steaks? One steak, though? Why? I want more steaks. Wait, you got two emeralds for three cooked chicken. I mean, that is not bad of a deal. If you don't mind, I'm going to sell you out on all your cooked chicken, okay? <laughs> if I come back, I will be using your business at any attire that you would like. I love this mod so freaking much. Basically for the purpose of like the space that you have in these buildings. Usually this chest. Yep. 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 Diamond baby. Anvil if you don't mind. There we go. All right. See, it's always worth coming to this building. To this castle especially because like you get some really good loot out of it. What is this? This is a dungeon tower. Yes. Oh my God. Yes. This is what we're looking for right here. This is it. A lot of good loot here. A lot of good starter loot. Yes. Bonner. Oh, what is that? Uncommon painted tower shield. Oh, yeah, I'll take that. Went on hands. Oh, yeah, I'll take that. Oh, my God. Chain gloves. Oh, I can't drink the potion. None shall be in the way of Sir Is Kevin as we travel through this uh, monstrosity or whatever. Okay. With the chest. Oh, my. There's the chest. Mine up the spawner. Oh, wait, that goes down more. Okay, so we're going to go loot on each side, and I think it's that one that goes down even further into the dungeon. So, boom, just like that. Another spawner right here. Get that one. Get that one done. This one done. Uh, Close quarters. Okay, that's cool. Or it, it looks, it literally looks like Skyrim. Okay, there we go. There we go. There we go. Mine up this. Knockback one. Not too shabby. A compass, which I think we're going to... 
turn into a nature's compass. I don't know if they have that mod in here, but we'll see. But dude, like, look at this. Look at all this stuff. I'm gonna mine this. We're gonna go down into the dungeon a little bit deeper because I know that's where all the good loot is. I'll take the apples. Okay, that dungeon's just a little broken on that side. Like an old ruin. Hey, that was a task. Whoa, what are these? Enchanted scroll of stuffed V? Wait, what? Enchanted scroll of rampant rampage four? <laughs> what the heck, dude? What are those things? They look awesome. Brought two. Yeah, it's definitely worth coming here. I think it's just this one other one over here. Whoa, 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 whoa. We got some really cool stuff in here. Running out of porches though. Whoa, what is that? It's red. Does that mean it's really good? I think that's, uh, once we turn that left corridor, I think that's pretty much it. And yeah, it kind of ends here. An energetic beverage. Okay. Oh man, it goes deeper? Oh my god, okay. Kinda like where this is going. Oh, that's a poisonous spider. Oh, this is gonna be the annoying one. Oh, I don't know if I'm gonna be able to keep going. I, I have wood, I can make myself another iron sword. Not a problem. Spawner, oh my god, there's a lot of spawners here. Oh yeah, there's a lot here. Okay, we're gonna recuperate real quick. There's a lot of spawners here. Holy jumping. All right, hang on. We're gonna recuperate. Iron sword. So can you mix two of these guys? Let's see what we get. Just another common. I mean, that's fine. I'm good with a iron sword. Spawner there. Okay, got that one. Yeah, we missed a lot. Oh my God, mythic grave metal leggings. Holy shit. Holy shit. This artifact within eight blocks radius can be disabled. Pneumatic ring. Okay, so here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to put this away, that away, that away, this way, that, that. This one gives only a 25% armor stat. <laughs> uh, I think we got to go this way now to finish off the actual dungeon itself. There is a Unbreaking 2 book here. There's another village over here. Do you see? I didn't see this before. Yeah, I don't know if I want to go to this thing. There's stuff to dig out here. I don't remember. <laughs> Hey, what what's a seal in French? And oh, fuck. <laughs> Dude, strictly medieval Minecraft has got to be one of the biggest quest trees I've ever seen. Wait, they don't have end remastered here? Thank God. <laughs> Thank God. Yeah, I literally think that this, this village here is like a duplicate of the one that we were in. Or not? Wait, what? Well, this place is trippy. Look who's here. Looky, looky. Oh, well, I'm going to increase my HP if you don't mind. All right, I'm going to need that because whenever we go back home, we're going to officially have two waste zones so that way we can go back to another place. Where is he? He's fast. Crocodiles deal a lot of damage. There you go. He's dead. Yeah, this is a pretty big village. Whoa. I think it's time because we got to make an enchantment table. So what is this horn glider statue? So six essence gets you a heart container. So you need a emerald and a essence. So this is a different kind of statue that kind of works out. So I hear villagers in here. Oh yeah, here we go. Got an achievement for that. Advancement made. Skyward city. All right. I got a book and quill here. Uh, we got a lot of bee cages. And uh, oh yeah, no way. I'm gonna keep. I'm gonna bring that home. Whoa. Yeah, this is basically like an end city just made out of wood, but it's in the overworld. That's pretty trippy. Impaling five and a night scroll used to forge Skofung back to its original form. With emerald ore? Just Why do you guys just have ore up here? Oh my god, yeah, I definitely want to grab that one. We're going to put this one away. Let's try it. <laughs> that didn't work. What do you got? You got another hunter's belt. Ooh, that's a nice pickaxe. All right, start making ways home. Drop off some stuff. Then we're going to go mining. Go back into that cave to get like that arc arc light something and some of the other ores that were there. All right. I'm going to put it right here. We're going to name this one home. Give us a little bit of a jump scare. Keep them away. I'll put it over here. Then do this. And you get yourself a diamond pickaxe. We got a hasteful crystalline pick. That's pretty good with 10% dig speed. Not too shabby. I ain't gonna complain about that. 
Yeah, we got a little hole by our house here. The fun part. Oh, yeah, I gotta love that. 100 mining. Woo! Vein mine, boo! Is that a ghost right there? Whoa! Dark vortex. So here you go. You see, you got deep slate, arcane crystal ore, which we can mine with that. Ow. There's a forgotten guy with 60 HP who's not really moving. Kind of just stuck there. <laughs> Drop the helmet, though. Whoa, that's a pretty cool helmet. Look at that. Okay, let's keep on going. Oh, okay, he's gone. Oh, there's that. That's a big chunk. What is that? Deep slate onyx ore. I'll grab that, I guess. For the mob spawner, get the thingy majiggies. Endurance XP bottle. Oh, yeah, he's there. He's there. He's there. Uh, warp scroll. Let's go. Uh, we have thorns three book. We got an empty farming XP bottle. Arcane crystal ore. Whatever this does. And voila. Okay, so this needs diamond pickaxe, which is deep runic. What is that? Rune. It's a rune. Okay, that's pretty cool. <laughs> <laughs> this is just underground. Whoa, a phantom creeper? There we go. Get rid of that bad boy. Okay, some magic. I don't mind that at all. I'm gonna grab this whole node. Give me. Oh, I broke the egg. Pickaxe. Okay. Bam. Mob spawner. Which I'm gonna. Gra oh, I know if I break this. Oh, shit. I forgot that the thing exists. Freaking trap. We can fight the Lich King if we get three or more. Three more of those guys. Drop some really good books. Saw the XP thing here. We're getting deeper and deeper now. Bloodstone. Yeah, we're gonna grab some of this too. I didn't want them to blow up my rubies. More bloodstone. Yeah, I don't know if I'm gonna be needing any of this stuff, but I'm gonna grab it anyways. Honestly, I think we could probably head back up to start making some of our armor sets. Cause look, a helmet only needs two. A chest, wait, we also needed rubies. A chest plate needs, oh, we need steel. How the hell do you make steel? Oh, you have to cook an iron ingot to make steel. Okay. I think we, I think, uh oh, oh my God. I did not mean to do that. <laughs> All right. Oh, we weren't far from home actually. Oh yeah. We got three more spirit orbs. I think I might go with stamina this time. And then we're going to smelt the iron into steel. Or do you need a blast furnace for that? Hang on. It looks like we need a blast furnace. Okay. Oh, there it is. Okay, let's smelt the 25 here to steel. I don't know how long it takes. Ooh, that's quite a lot. That's quite a bar. At the beginning, we also got some more stuff here. Pirates of the Caribbean gives us more XP. We got this and some rewards. We got sugar, some leather, and that. We also got an ordnance trident. Um, bosses of mass destruction. We, oh my God, that gave us two free soul stars. Oh, that's external. Then Jade Samurai. So you could take Jade Samurai and then turn it into an A+, plus, but yeah, this is definitely a big upgrade for us anyways. Crafted. Oh, let's go! Oh man, we got a magical Jade Samurai chest plate, dude. Look at that. Mana regen, 75% spell power. That's insane. That's really good. Okay, so what about the helmet now? Please not a common. Please not a common. Oh, we got... <laughs> let's go, dude. Six max HP. Oh my god. Oh, no freaking way, dude. Look at that. 100 idle stamina regen with 12 max HP, 10 armor stats. Jesus Christ. All right, all right, all right. Something good here. Not common. Oh, my God. Unchained. I mean, we get two minus an armor, but we get 25% attack damage. I mean, let's. You want, do we want to try our luck again? We can make another set. Might as well. Let's see what we get. Oh, you see that's great. Dude, I'm excited to put this armor on. And we're gonna make an enchantment table and get this get these guys enchanted. But look at this, boys. Alright, here we go, boys. Bam, 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 bam. <laughs> oh, what is the slowness though? Wait, do we not have enough Oh endurance level 35, boys? We can't wear it. Damn it. What level are we right now in endurance? 27. We gotta go level up our endurance then. We need to level up our endurance in order to wear the entire set. But you know what? We can wear the diamond helmet for now because I know that this helmet is going to break. Make some new pants. Oh, that's that's even better from what I was expecting. And uh, let's make another pair. Got to get something good. Here we go. Magical. That's fine with me. So literally, if I let something hit me a bajillion times, I can't see. My eyes are playing tricks on me, man. Oh, here it is. 
It says Minecraft, so I think it's just retextured. So I guess we're going to wait for the blue. Once it's in blue, then it means it's night. Okay, well, let's go back into our cave and let's go take some damage. Literally just tank it until we're level 35 so we can wear that jade armor because I really want to wear it and not be slowed and have weakness and stuff. Yeah, but it doesn't go up very much. Okay, we'll let the skeleton hit us. There we go. How long is it going to take? I'm not sure, though. It's going up by one. There. Actually, you you may not be as good. Skeleton with an arrow in his head again. Blow me up. Hello, Mr. Tortoise. Oh. Uh, zombies don't deal much endurance, but god damn, dude. It's, it's slow. Did the zombie give up? The zombie gave up. What the heck, dude? That is hilarious. The zombie was just giving up. 29. Oh, there we go. Now we're talking. Yeah. Yes. Okay. Okay, hang on, hang on, hang on. I actually might die. Definitely worked. We went up already two whole levels. Oh, that guy's disgusting. Oh, look at that. Siamese skeletons. Okay. Hang on, how much is he giving me? Oh! Oh! Um, don't care what the value is of it. And then I can make another set of boots. 32. Come on. 33. Oh, copper ingot with gold. Put that in a paladin forge. Okay, we need a paladin forge. In order to start making any of this cool stuff, we need a paladin forge. Oh, dude, we're so close. We're like two levels, just two levels away, dude. Whoa, Heart of the Golem. Whoa. Wait, what? That is cool. Oh, God, the spiders. I wonder if there's silk touch spawners in this, too. Cloud jumper. Ooh. Is it this? Oh, my God, it's right there. Okay, we, we equipped it. Will that give us? Oh, not bad. Not bad. Not bad. Magic XP. Which ain't too bad. Pants. Chest plate. Let's get us our, our thingy majiggy, right? We can save the rest of the diamonds for another time. Need a diamond sword now. Give me all the bad boys. Oh god, not the cave spider though. I don't want the cave spider. There we go. Everything else is good, but the cave spider, okay? Uh, like this, like this. There we go. Nice set of boots. Come on, come on. Yes, level thirty-five. We got it. All right, we just get we get a little bit more. Oh, dude, we got it. We got it. We got it. We got it. Okay, we can get out of here now. Okay, let's sleep real quick before this guy gets me. I can see him in the trees. Damn it. Bleep, 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 bleep. All right, dude. Oh, let's go. Let's go, man. Oh, that is awesome. Now, look at us. Look at us go, bro. We are now in style. We are a samurai basically gives us one armor so we're only losing one armor stat but look at those bars that we have already like look at this like that is insane now the next thing to do is to actually enchant this stuff or make the paladin paladin what is it paladin forge like how the hell do you make this thing that's it oh shit you need a full block of arc light and we needed polished deep slates we gotta go back into the cave but looks like we need an entire block of arc light and plus two and we only have eight we, we almost have enough for an entire block, so we need to get more arc light. If we could find that cave that we were in uh, that has, like, all that arc light, we get 21. I uh, see. Maybe I could have made, like, the enchanting area over here, you know? That looks kind of dumb. <laughs> oh, my God. That scared the shit out of me, dude. Just flattened out this area. Uh, We need to make the enchanting table, so we're going to do... So we need to put an enchantment table there. We gotta go get uh, obsidian. We gotta find a, like a lava pit. We're also gonna mark down where the staircase is, so that way I don't lose it. Whoa! Overpowered zombie! Oh, he dropped a diamond backpack. Let's go, dude. I like that. Oh, it's got a disc. All right, that's cool. I like that. That is another source of lava. We're going all the way up into the main freaking land dude so that stream of lava literally goes gonna go like that there you go four pieces of obsidian perfect honestly we should probably like mark where this is because this goes right down to that cave 
There we go. Enchanting table. We also have a diamond backpack with some crap in it. Oh my god, there's an endurance thing in here. Let me go like that. Oh, we do. Ew, fire prod. That's disgusting. More of our quest logs, because this nomad stuff gives us a full block of netherite, in which we can make gilded netherite, basically, and make a... Oh my god, dude. There, this thing. Dormant eye. Charm. It connects to the location beyond your space and time. You can awaken the eye if you wish to risk drawing attention of someone or something. Oh, okay. We also have to make a research table for any of this stuff. So like Phoenix fight. Uh, no, like this. Infinity ham. Okay. Unbreaking three. Fire prot. Yeah. You know what? I'll put it on because it has unbreaking three for now. It's not the greatest. Lightweight three, which is pretty sick. Lapis with one enchantment level. Let's see what we get here. Prot three with lightweight three. I will I will actually take that. You know what? I ain't going to complain about it. Lightweight three again with prot four. No unbreaking, but lightweight three again. Unbreaking two with... Oh, that is the perfect... Perfect. Unless we want to re-roll this one. I feel like I want to re-roll the chest plate because the chest plate is always obviously more important. So let's put that in there. On breaking three, prop four. There we go. That's the one that we want. We are literally untouchable. Wait, hang on. Oh, wait. I don't know. We can might as well keep the fire prop for now because we don't have enough XP levels. But look, we're basically god tier like gods now. And also we also have the... Oh, not that one. What is the key for... What is it for the skill tree? Is it left? Right alt. Ah, oh, here we go pretty sweet oh my god we already have a full ass inventory though that's insane look dude you have this on the counterweight you get more armor stats and then like five max health if you have a shield in hand like like 0.1 attack damage per armor hello five armor five blocking dude 10 blocking five percent armor five percent melee damage like look at this 20 percent melee damage up here like this and go like that and then keep going up here up here up here like, we're just going to keep following this path right here. We literally, like, will become the ultimate actual tank that we actually want to be. <laughs> but I think our next goal is literally to make the um, Paladin Forge. Because, well, a lot of this armor that we want to make, Paladin. Like, look at all this freaking sick armor that we can make, dude. It's, it's going to take some time to actually get all of this stuff done. But look, whenever we get there, like, this pack has got a lot of stuff that it's got to offer. But I ain't complaining. Get out of the bed, man. I got to sleep dude there is a lot of boss killing that we have to go do so we got uh, we got mousies we got mo boss bosses of mass destruction the void worm and also the uh, captain cornelia then we also have a bunch of like the skill leveling and the development so we also have create you know ignatic ignatic legacy forbidden and arcanus all this other stuff and we also have other dimensions to go to so i don't know about you guys but i kind of like the skill leveling a lot <laughs> level 65 in mining so you get a swift gobber pickaxe and then you also get mending whenever you get to level 60 in mining level 50 combat gets you the extended gilded netherite so we get tarot cards wait what 50 percent base reach distance we can actually go back and explore again let's see if we can find any sort of like boss arenas unless we just go back mining again okay let's just make like eight chests i think that's a trough but who cares i might just put it right on top of there so there's one Oh my god, that's a legendary and an epic. My crafting is getting a lot better. That is 100% true. Is that a pillager? Come on. Come a little closer now. <laughs> what? <laughs> what is happening? <laughs> what the hell, dude? Oh my god. Alright, let's put our armor to the test. And that was easy. You guys suck, dude. Yeah, like, look at that, dude. Hello, Mr. Kampa. How are you? Uh, you, you are here in a civilized area. I got charisma by, like, talking to this guy and get infinite charisma. And I become the absolute Riz Lord. I'm going to Riz up this camper. Hey, man. You from around these neck of the woods? Because I would like to touch... I'm not gonna, fi <laughs> I'm gonna finish that. Knock, knock. Who's there? It is I. You got a smithing XP. All right. Do we cross the waters and see what's going on over there? Because this village is pretty nice, but it's not exactly what we're looking for. So either we can go this way or we keep going down this forest. We're going to see what's going to happen. I'm going to take a sip of my energy drink. Hey, also, if there's like any energy drink brands out there that want to sponsor me, I'm addicted to caffeine. So I'm just, I just might be your guy. <laughs> the sting. <laughs> Hello. How's it going, man? Uh, 
Okay, these guys are not even dealing any damage to me. They're shooting me, but they're not doing any damage. Okay, there it is. Perfect. Knowledge of death in which I will put something in there if I know how to... Oh, yeah, click here. There it is. The drowned belt. Yeah, oh, silk touch. Don't mind if I do. We also need to have like a fishing episode. We got to level up our fishing. Oh, this is the captain's quarters. There we go. Na, 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 na. We also have to try to get mending. So those villagers that we have that are kind of close by, we're going to try to make a mending villager, which is going to be greatly be of use to us. Oh, look, a house. Wait, Jaws? What do you mean? Oh, oh, it's a remains. The time is of the days of where Megalodon still exists and humankind is where it is now. The year is 2024 and we've been battling the Megalodon for ages and ages. Now you, young viewer, are have a harpoon in hand and a scuba gear of the almighty. Diving deeper into the water, you spot the Megalodon. <laughs> <laughs> what do you do? What do you do when you see a gigantic shark like that, dude? I don't know. I have no idea. What we're trying to look for right now is another dungeon. A far out area. So once we're in the dungeon and it's deep, we can just go and mine from there. Wait a minute. What if we went back to the other dungeon that we went to and went into that giant cave that was there? Dude, how many goddamn villages are there? Holy shish kebabs. This is like the other village that we saw on the other side. We climbed that tower looking tower before. Wait a second. No, that's a waste stone. Oh my god, it's an actual fully built waste stone tower that's not half broken. Oh my god. We are going to climb it. And I bet there's a paraglider because look at our stamina. Look at that. That's the paraglider stamina. Gimme, gimme, gimme. Gimme, yeah, yeah. I feel it. In my bones, and I feel it in my skin. I'm not well. <laughs> I'm betting. My oh my god, what is all these yellow dots on the map? I hope that is fish. Ooh, a knock knock, who's there? It is I. Here. Oh yes, there's drowned here. Is that a jail? Oh wait, that's a dungeon hole or a mine shaft. Yeah, here it is. Hello. There's no chest up here. There looks like there's a spawner over there. A space di dissector. All right, I'm going to dissect the space. An ancient scroll of reach. An increase in range and hit creatures of harvest. Uh, all your nearby allies would benefit from the magic effect. For 10 minutes. All right, so what do I got to do? Oh, tattered tome. I gained some knowledge from it. Okay. Oh my god, there's just a waystone right here. I don't know if there's anything other good loot in that building, but I'm not sure. Oh, is it a dungeon for drowned folks? That's why there's a lot of drowned in here. All right, let's go take a look what we're at, what we're doing here. Aha! Huzzah! Now there's more undead drowned guys. Here we go. Ooh! Nice! What did I just do? I don't know. My reach has increased now. Look at that! Woohoo! Give me a get the hell out of my dungeon. <laughs> All right, no chests in here. The architect's ink well. All right, cool. We also got a bomb, but I'm going to dig this one hole right here without trying to die. Cause this is oh, there's nothing. Okay, got that and whatever, whatever this is. Wait, whoa! I'm definitely excited to explore it all. Like, look at these big boys. The pink sand. Oh, that's pretty. All right, how deep does it go? Oh, it goes deep. There's some lava down there, too. So how do you like the uh, these neck of the woods, huh? Pretty good? No? Okay. Just to ignore me. Fine, then. I'll just go my own way, then. What is an XP thing? Do you guys think I can make that? Oh, shit. Oh, my God. Oh. Oh, there's an ancient city down there. I spawned a warden, I think. We'll keep going. We're going to see what this building is. Hopefully, it's one of those dungeon towers. Whoop. Huzzah! Yes, okay, good. Oh, shit, yeah, I forgot. We have to do this thing. Hang on, chat. Ah, yeah, here it is. Okay, here we go. So we have two, actually. Uh, I think we're gonna go more XP. Hopefully, it's gonna take us deep into the caves so that we can go mining from there. I mean, torches would be even better, but we don't kind of have those right now, so gotta do what we got. Usually, these things got, uh, they got the Dreadnought, uh, dude. The Dreadnought Moxie boss, which is pretty sweet. Sorry about that, guys. Grab this spawner real quick. Dude, we're gonna get so many spawner fragments and stuff, man. Ha <laughs> ha. An energetic beverage. Oh my god, speaking of caffeine. What does this do? Let's drink it. Whoa! I'm on drugs! 
I'm on drugs. Oh, that's not a door. I'm on drugs. Oh shit. Oh, even my attack speed is up, dude. Oh my god. The real life of effects of drinking energy drinks. Holy, holy moly, holy moly moly. Oh, then crap. Okay. Play some hot scotch going back. But like here, no, nothing, nothing. Nothing, not a, okay. Is that it for the cave, bro? There's no way. I was expecting more. I want to go deeper. I want to go deeper and deeper into the caves. Yeah, so we can go into this cave. More ruins. Oh, wait. Is that more of the dungeon down here? Ah! There is more dungeon. I feel like there's boss. There's supposed to be bosses in these places, but... Oh, nice. What is that? Heart of the Earth. Okay, cool. Whatever that is. Oh, boy. Another crack in a can. I love cracking a can, dude. Sure, I'm not. I'm not skilled enough to break it. Yeah. Uh. Uh. Whoa! What the frick is that thing, dude? Bruiser. You come for a bruising? You're getting so many freaking spawners. Oh no! I. I didn't mean to hurt you, bro. Oh, that was Luma. I thought it was cracking a can. And this dungeon is even bigger than the ones I've seen before. Because it keeps going down into another level of it. What? Oh, we got a continental trophy. Hey, it's about time we were going to get one of these. Now we're in the gist of it. Oh, God. Whoa! Mana regen. Okay, I'll go with that. Where can we go? Do we keep going this way? I think it's going to be a dead end on this side, though. And then we're going to continue down going down this way. Because it seems like it keeps going but just a little bit further. All right, now we got to do this side. But I think the, I don't think this side is long. I think this is going to have the staircase. I think we're about good in, to be inside of a cave. Because we're at 8 level. So I think we should be able to start going into an actual cave system. So there is one that is like right here. I don't know how deep we have to go in to get into this cave, but it should be if we turn left. Subscription checkpoint. Make sure to sub. If you're not sub, sub right now. Do it. Yeah, here we go. Ain't mine now to get a bunch of XP. Okay, here we go. Let me go down. Stop. This right here. There's so much of it. Oh, don't mind if I do. 13, baby. Let's go. Oh, no, there is end remastered. Oh, no. Totally forgot there was end remastered, guys. We are in trouble. Our days have come. Oh, more XP. Here we go. Look at that. Boink. Whoa. What is that guy? Oh, shit. Cave Enderman. Sweet. My name is Jeff. Oh, my God. Look at that. Jesus. <laughs> we need more of that, right? Okay. I somehow have to be really sneaky on this while I don't move. There we go. We're good. I didn't want to freaking ward in the spawn. I'm surprised it doesn't like get captured by the rest of these dudes. All right, let's get the heck out of here. It end with some jade here. Oh, there's a... Ouch, man. Arc light. But I'm going to grab one of our waystones. And I, we're actually going to like, we're going to name this cave. Because that is just an insane amount of arc light that we have now. 41 arc light. 41. What the flip, dude? What the flip the flips? Block of arc light. Boom. Paladin Forge. Look at that, boys. We're making some progress. I think we're going to put it like right here. There we go. That's good. So now we can actually start to make some very cool stuff. Okay. So I think we're going to go with the arc light sword. Because we got, a, we got a lot of arc light. But there was another set of armor that I wanted to test out with the Paladin Forge while we wait for the arc light to be ready. So then you go, uh, is it? Iron, diamond, that, and then it, oh, okay, it slowly cooks, look at that, now we wait, oh, here we go, steel knight, okay, so you just throw that in here, like that, that's gonna start to cook, oh, there it is, all right, now we're gonna do the pants, okay, here's the helmet, you know what that helmet looks like, you know what this helmet looks like, it's really buggy, it looks like goblin slayer, got the steel knights, yeah, that, that is 100% goblin slayer, so if I, like, take these off, yeah, that is. Like, if it wasn't for my head being so big and the model of the, the armor looking so small. I, I, honestly, it's just because of the, the red feathers at the top. And the way his sh his pauldrons are made. Definitely. All right, well, then we're going to start making arc light. Why do I do that? Goddamn, I'm dumb. Okay, so here's the full set of gear, which looks pretty good. I think the modeling is good, but it, the, the helmet doesn't fit. So, dear texture dude make helmet fit unless it's just it's because the mud that is being used in here is not sufficient one two three four is it gonna start oh my god it's going look at that oh that is so cool oh that is neat okay let's do this are we ready oh. 
How much HP are we at, dude? I just kept going. I'm in green hearts. Wait, hang on. Am I at full saturation now? I just spent like a stack and like 16 orbs. Did we have any more? I know we did. Yeah, we have one right here. And I swear to you, if I can continue going with more HP. Oh my God. If it's, I think it's probably two more sets, honestly. So we're going to go with uh, more stamina here so we can sprint for longer. Is it this? Combat. Oh, this is the level. We have four arc light alloy. Oh, dude, we're going to need more than that, right? Because we need pickaxes and stuff. Arc light pickaxe in which it's just a normal rarity. And then we're also going to make a arc light shovel. So what if we just chop down all of this? All right. Holy shit. Dude, this is just amazing. There we go, level five excavation. Level 35, not level five, level 35. Now we can actually wield this. Yes, there we go. All right, we have five there. X, arc light sword, which should be better, but I don't think so because the legendary crystalline glaive is, sounds like it's gonna be a lot better in terms of damage, but I don't know. Look, the sword uh, does a bit more damage and it's, a cool sword. It matches, kind of matches with the armor though. Not gonna lie. It's a pretty nice sword. Not too shabby. There you go. Bookshelf. This. There we go. So let's try to get a villager with mending. Unemployed villager. Got a lectern. Someone take the job. Unbreaking and night scroll. Use the forge. I don't want this. I'm sorry. I just need mending. Lightweight. I think it's nighttime now. And we are gonna go to the nether. I mean, I could probably put it like right there. Whoa, wait, what? That is cool. Legendary cere ceremonial armor. Oh, dude, look at that. We look like a knight. A knight in shining armor. You know what? Here's a question, an ultimate question for you all. What is your favorite month out of the year? Me personally, I love September. September's a good uh, good time of the year. Reason number one, it's like not super hot outside. Uh, reason number two, uh, I like the changing the colors of the leaves, you know? Looks pretty good, pretty schnazzy. As much as I do like summer, September is also just not super hot. It's a bit cooler out. Need some wood. Four, right? And then one, two, right there, which we'll put like right there. And now I gotta do like a staircase kind of thing on the top of it, so. Perfect and schlong. That looks pretty good, you know? You kind of just do this like that, right? <laughs> right. <laughs> you put like that. Some sort of wall situation, but at the same time, it. I don't know. I kind of like it. Oh, at least a floor. I need a floor. A floor would be pretty good. What do you guys think? A floor would be good? If you ask me on a different day, I will just tell you that I'd just be chopping up the wood all day so I can just go home and put some shit in my chest. So I did the typical reorganizing the entire setup and labeling everything and labeling all the chests so I can get everything But hey, organized. man, I like you guys, though. You can, you guys can subscribe if you want a little checkpoint. Make sure to sub if you like the content so far. Let me know on any thoughts that you guys want to see next on, like, in uh, in terms of content of this channel, I don't know what I'm saying now. <laughs> we have some manorals. Put the manorals away. We have a dark rod. Rocket man. Hey, hey, hey. Oh, chicken in the corn. Chicken in the corn. That's it. Chicken in the corn. <laughs> that was so dumb, dude. I am so dumb. There we go. Look at that. Frickin' A, boys. We're making some good progress. And remember, folks, this is not normal. For me to get organized this early on in my 100 days yes, adventure. Yes, that's the one I'm looking for. This is... Yes, there we go. I knew I still had the mod in here. All right, we're on day 35. Now, we can just simply look. And now we can see that we have a point of interest. Orange juice, you need to add zero, uh, zero, zero, zeros or whatever it's called mini maps in this pack zeros is just the way to go okay i am so sorry ftb and journey maps suck okay all right we got our lava source oh man here we go all right i think that's good oh yeah this map is just so much better dude oh my god we traveled further than i expected oh yeah i love this map dude the details on this map is just so good man 
Also, uh, a little uh, in, in, in FYI for a lot of the uh, people that are watching this video. If you have a mod pack that you've been working really hard on that has a lot of content and stuff and you want someone to play your pack, feel free to message me by joining our Discord server and uh, just piquing interest for me to visit your pack and wanting me to play your pack because I love showing love to a lot of smaller packs. Uh, so yeah, feel free to message me anytime. Real uh, packs only. Okay, uh, I'm gonna say that now. Only real packs. Like, if you have a pack that's just like, you know, 50 mods, I'm not gonna play it. <laughs> Alright, there you go. I need flint to light it up now. We got one flint. Our portal's gonna get lit. So, to, uh, to make these cores for the paladin armor... Holy shit, dude. How long is it gonna take? Oh, there we go. Oh, gross. Well, this place seems fun. Are you ready? Uh, yeah, I am very ready. Okay, so first things first, number one most important rule. We're gonna take this. Just perfect. Oh, that's a piglin spawner? There we go. We're right in it. Another gobber rod. So in order to make the cores for my arc light armor, I am needing 10 wither skills. So I got to pay real close attention to any of this stuff that's in here. Like this guy right here. These guys. I need to kill them all. Oh, we already got one. Oh my God. What is this luck? Okay. I thought I dropped two. Dude, I was like, bro, there's no way I just dropped two. All right. We already got one. We're already off to a good start, boys. Already off to a good start. What's that? It's an Easter egg. Okay, hang on. I got a lot of health. Here, let's kill these guys first. There we go. I'm one-tapping these guys, too. No! Stop giving me, giving me shards of malice. I want wither skulls. Damn it. Do you like all of them? Could have given me a lot more. A lot more than what I'm needing. I got two from that. Let's go. All right. That's, it ain't that bad. Ooh, netherite. Let's go. The wither chest plate, wither rose, and wither chest plate. Okay. So what does a wither chest plate do? Let your attackers wither. There's a pot here. Ooh, give me a diamond. Wanted a wither skeleton skill. All right. Now we got staircases, which is what we're more looking into. There it is. Is that a blaze spawner? Yeah, it is. Okay. Thank God we have a bit of fire protection. Another wither skeleton. Come on over here, buddy. Yeah, so we're going to continue. Just got to be very careful of this biome because it, it's kind of insane. Not going to lie. But I like this one. All right. What is this place? What is this place? Oh, my God. It's right here. So we're going to fight that nether gauntlet very soon. I just don't think my... I don't have any bows or arrows on me to actually fight that guy. Probably head back home at some point and try to figure it out. Wait, what? Yeah, this thing usually has a lot of good stuff. Hang on. Grab that. A withered tome. Oh, nice. Sharp diamond spear. Oh, another red ingot. There you go. Look at that, guys. We're getting all their attention now. Yeah, I need to get out. Okay, there we go. We got a really bad spawn in the nether. I'm gonna jump onto the gauntlet arena. Holy shit, dude. It's just all lava. Like, look at that. I need the magma walker boots. Like, this is absolutely insane, dude. What is this nether? What is that? Okay, so if I can just get to that plateau... I think I'll be off to a good start, but I need some building blocks. Hang on, let's just vein mine this. I'm gonna walk around, I guess. Rectangular structures are typically bastions. Well, that's kind of just right there. Do we want to go loot that? Yeah, I'm sure it's probably got some decent loot in it. Stored experience? Oh, look at that! It just gave me free XP! Nice, okay. Honestly, look, dude. There's another nether fortress right there. That is a good sign. That means more withers, which means more wither skills in which we can fight more withers. Okay, let's freaking go, dude. Let's see if we can find any withers in here. If we can find and spot withers. Okay, hang on. We're gonna call this fortress. We're going home. Okay, we're gonna try to get fortune three on our sword. Demon Slayer, Bane of Arthropods. No, we don't want Demon Slayer. Looting one. Oh. Looting three! Oh, yeah, let's go, dude. That's exactly what we were wanting. Right there, look at that. Look at that shit. Frick, yes. 
We didn't have to enchant too long. We can do it. Sometimes you get those structures that have... Oh, like this. This one. This one. This one. This this structure has it. It's got the tower. It's got a bunch of wither skeletons in it. Oh, yes. I am, I am happy about this. Nothing, dude. That is so odd. We also have another waystone, which is not a problem. Uh, wait, no. This is a bastion thingy, Majiggy. Yeah, I don't know. I, I feel like we'd be more lucky to find another dungeon and then go to the bottom of it to the nether one and then farm with our skeletons because they can spawn a bunch of times. I feel like that's what I want to do. I think it's a bastion, but we're going to call it that. So it's three levels to teleport back. It's nighttime. I'm going to sleep. God damn, dude. At least we can fight one. Grab the job. Try again. Efficiency five, man. I would die for efficiency five. Actually, you know what? The no, don't take that job, you dumb dumb. You are no longer able to go outside. All right, I give up. I give up for now. You, uh, you suck, and I'm not building you a house. Oh, all right. Do we want to go this way now? Yeah, we're going to go this way. Uh, unfortunately, I don't have any more waystones, so we're going to have to find some on our way. Yeah, look at this. Hang on. Dude, I'm still able to do more Look, I got another row of hearts. I'm in blue. Whoa. Okay. There's a broken hole in here. Oh, shit. Okay, it is some sort of dungeon. Okay. Ow. Oh, wait a minute. Is that what I'm seeing on the map? There's two of them, I think. Oh, waystone. Nice. And don't mind if I take this waystone. These ones typically have the gold at the top of it, right? If I remember. And I think that's everything. You know what? I'm just going to hit the leaves. I should catch my fall. Yep. Like I said. All right. So let's go this way. There's like a big massive structure or something. Let's check this thing out first. Seems like a whole lot of nothing. Are you having a camp over here, buddy? Got a Tasmanian devil. What's up, big boy? You're on the wrong parts of my town. You better, you best get, you, you best uh, get going. Oh, I think that's a pillager camp. Oh, oh nice room. Legendary chainmail. No, the ghost. Looks like there's a waystone tower over there, and we're going to continue on our ways and journeying forward. But I think that's the tower there. Wait, why Why is he so big? <laughs> that is like a human-sized ant. Okay, here we go. Waystone! Yes, let's go, dude. That's what I'm talking about. Whoa, what is that? Actually, what is this? Yeah, I'm going to fall in the leaves. It's a monkey! Oh my god, I got another airship. There's so many of these things. Wait, what is that right there? That looks like that is something. Oh, it's a pillager tower. We're bringing justice and democracy. Die, you infamous being. Okay. I'm chicken in the corn. Where the corn can grow. Mama. Dude, how tall is this thing? Ow. Ow. We're going to put away somewhere to say ship. That is so fair. Hey. Get rid of the freaking spawner. <laughs> Zombie brute. Holy freaking diamonds. Ow. Yeah, they keep spawning on me. I want to keep that spawner here, though. Okay. Okay, go home. Home, 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 home. Whew. Okay. No! A freaking raid! No! No! I should have... Oh, my God. I, I, I forgot, dude. I forgot. Okay, let's fight off the raid. Then we're going to go back. Hello? Yo, like, the, vil the, the warrior guys are taking care of them pretty good. Oh, yeah. They're at my house. Get the hell out of my house! You think this is fun and games? I ain't scared of you, bro. You think I'm scared of you? Dude, I'm a massive freaking tank. Doesn't have a tear. Freaking necromancer. You stupid witch. If we win... Yeah, that's it, boys. You don't mess. You don't. You 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 mess with the bull. You get the uh the horns. Chicken in the corn, so the corn can grow. Yeah. I feel like this is that's gonna be <laughs> the song of the day, man. But here, ow! What the heck, bro? What the heck, bro? He froze all my hearts. Look at how many rows of hearts I have. I didn't actually notice. Look at that. That's insane. Okay, I keep getting shot by something. Oh yeah, here you are. Uh, 
Okay, there is a lot of wither skeleton spawners in here, which is perfect. So that's a wither skeleton spawner right there. Oh, dude, we already got a wither skeleton skull. Dude, this place is like a goddamn maze. What the hell is wrong? <laughs> that is the coolest looking mob I've seen. Oh, wait, we accomplished something too. Click here. Oh, yeah, here we go. Cost one point. We can get 100% experience. So let's do that. I hate these freaking phantoms, bro. Just burn. Why aren't they burning? And sticks and stones may break my bones, but friendship never hurts me. How many do we get? None! Man, we're gonna be farming here a while, dude. If I stand in that one corner, they tend- Oh! I grabbed one! I got one! Okay. Oh god, I don't like all these clouds, dude. We have this thing. Axe of Executioner. A 10% 10, 10 chance of beheading. It's just one wither skull, which we have enough for. We need blaze powder, a blaze rod. We could probably make this and actually use it. Level 50 combat, boys. Oh, we got five! Oh, that is amazing. Hmm, I don't know. Do we want to just keep doing this? Do we skip the, the ex execution thing? I'm going to look up what are the drop percent chances of getting the wither skeleton skills with looting three. They have a 2.5 chance, but with looting three, you get a 5.5% chance. Okay, guys, we, we are, we're building that axe. So essentially, you need blaze powder like that. And here you go. Axe of the Axe of Executioner. So this is the sword that we're going to use to kill the Wither Skeletons now. We can try to reroll our uh, our villager to see if we can get at least looting two. Or looting three would be pretty good. Fire aspect one. You know what? Let's, let's just take the 10% chance. Let's just take it. It's way better than five, right? Way, 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 way better. No, this is not good. What level do you have to be? You're not skilled enough to use the common axe of the executioner as a weapon. What do I need? I need combat 55? I think I picked one up. Yeah, I got nine. Like per hit I get is like 0.5 to level up that one area. I got 10. I'm liking the chances now where we just got two of them a lot faster, but the axe of the executioner wasted some netherite for that shit, man. Two more. Just two more, man. Come on. Come on, come on, come on. Yes! One more! Oh my god, there's no way! I did it! A skeleton playing the triangle! There's no way, guys, I just did it! Holy shit! I did it, I did it, I did it, I got them all! That is awesome! Well, now we're gonna go to the nether. We're gonna pick up some, uh, some soul sand. Hello, guys. Oh god, there's a blood-sucking mosquito! I hate those guys. Hey, maybe you guys have just have some soul sand. Soul sand! Oh, yeah, that's good. I love that. And then you have another Keystone of Oblivion. Wait, Keystone of Oblivion? That kind of reminds me of like... Oh, now that I think about it? What if it's like the, the dimension to go to Oblivion like in the game Oblivion? Inception. Did you see, did you see what I'm doing here, guys? Another Keystone of Oblivion. Let's glide away! Ow, dude. Get off me. Okay. We're going to keep that waystone there. Okay, so we're going to try to head over this way into the court desert. Yeah, we're going to go over there. Okay, here we go. Some wither skeletons. There's a chest over here. One of these things. This will have soul sand in it. There you go. Another piece. It's only one, but looks still useful. So far, it's not looking so good over here. We're going across. Easy peasy. Lemon squeezy. We're going to make it. No worries, baby. Netherite ingot! Let's go! Oh, these blocks of gold, too. You're dead, bro. Soul sand! Look at that! One piece! <laughs> That's what I was talking about, man. Give, 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 give! We're doing pretty good. We're doing pretty good. Let's let's go back home. Call it F2. Home. Here we go. Holy shit, dude. God damn! Yeah, that was kind of crazy. Alright, day 48, boys. We're already on some pretty good progress now. Increase the cap of the health some more. And it looks like we can. I think we're going for another whole row of health, actually. Oh, we have some string here. Okay, let's see if we can get uh, a bow that is legendary rarity. That's eh, a hasteful. What is the one? Okay, we'll put two commons together to get legendary. There we go. That's the one we kind of want. <laughs> Jesus. Okay, let's do it. Yes. Okay, we took a chance. We took a chance and we got it. Okay, one, two, three. Oh, wait, does it have to be, like, like, this? What is happening? 
I spoke with OJ, and I guess I was just try building it wrong for some somehow or some some way. I don't know. I was just building it backwards or something. Woo -hoo -hoo! Come on! Yeah, yeah, yeah! Ow! The world breathes relieved. Whoa! What the? So long, at least. Whoa, that was creepy. That was really creepy. Yo, we got so many heart containers. Holy shit. Wow. Okay, so we got a wither eye, which is perfect. We also got a reward. Oh, wait, can you only summon? Oh, can you only summon the wither at night? All right, well, we're going to get some more. S oh my God, you can kill more hearts. What the flip is that bullshit? Dude, <laughs> we got another row of hearts. Bang, bang. There we go. Okay, so it's he's very aggressive. The shell is gone. What a fallen presence will forever remain imprinted on this realm. Dude, it, it is so trippy. Oh my god, I just found something broken. Oh my god. Dude, you don't even need spirit orbs. All you need to do is just farm withers to get heart containers. You know that? You know how insane that is? That's all you need. Oh, wait. I got something. A critical thunder burn. Oh my. <laughs> Shit. But minus 10% attack damage. Oh, dude. What the heck? Oh my god. That is amazing. Two and three. There we go. Okay. Okay, all right, let's spot another. Got another six hearts. <laughs> oh, so stupid. Okay, we gotta hurry up and spawn him though, because the, the night is coming. One, two, three. There we go. Okay, last one. Let's go, dude. Let's go. Yes! <laughs> we need to go get the Paladin Forge, because if you want to make the Arc Light chest plate, right? Yeah, we're doing this one. Arc light chest plate. Because we just need an arc light core. So we need one netherite ingot, arc light alloy, nether star to get an arc light core. And then boom. Oh, it's going. And we also have a pair of boots. Okay, so we need a new helmet. Okay, so two commons gives us a fortified. All right, that's not bad. Oh, that is it. That is it. And then we'll put the smithing table about here. Netherite helmet. And then bam. Boom! Full set of netherite. That's not even enchanted yet, dude. Not even enchanted. Extended gilded netherite sword? Don't mind if I do. That is a free netherite sword. We can make like a really good sword with that, dude. Actually, it's day 50. We got the four arc light cores. Um, and then our netherite chest plate that's in there. So we need to make more arc light alloys. So how the hell do we make that again? Then one, two, three, four. And it should start cooking. Yes, sir. Oh, 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 oh. Wait, why is the boots like half? Oh my god, wait, endurance 150%? Okay, here we go. It should be done by now. Oh yeah, here it is. You put the helmet there, you put a core there, and then you put an arc light alloy there. Oh, it's going. <laughs> Let's go. Okay, here we go. Oh, let's go. Wait, what? Why is it common? Oh my god, that is so garbage. Why does it do that? Please, please. Wow, I feel scammed. I feel scammed. I re-rolled so many. But anyways, it does look awesome. That's all that matters. Our combat is increased by 100% when worn. So we can increase our combat level by a shit ton, which is like crazy. Oh, ho, ho. wait, what? No, unchained? Ew, damn it. This is not good. <laughs> Look at that. All right, what kind of boost do we get? Just light, oh my God, with one minus armor, lightly dented. That's gross. What is this? Why did it change everything? Dum, 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 dum. And if you click and you make the entire set of arc light, boom. Let's just hope we get, well, I would want three arc light pieces. We're going to see how much we, oh, we, I think we got two there. Yeah, we got two. A full netherite set will also give us an additional netherite ingot. And then another star will give us some more wither skulls and stuff like that. You know what? We're going to do it. We're always something else. Oh my God. We're so fast. So look at that. We got ourselves a little bit of wings now. Now, give me, like, legendary. Since it's a common and I'm making it into a better set, that there. 
and that in there, right? That should be starting to go. Yes, okay. I remember the recipe. All right, what do we got? Almond. Hey, a common is better than lightly dented. We have to go get some lapis so we can enchant all our armor set. <sighs> Uh, do we want to do it? I'm breaking with Prot 4 right here. Oh, yeah, that's it. Boom. Prot 4 on breaking with Thorns 2. Ooh, I don't know about that. We're really going to be needing that mending then if we want that to work out pretty well. Oh, yeah, that's a Gobber Sword, dude. We need a Gomber Ingot, which needs Gobber Ingot, Netherite Scale. Wait, what? Nether Gobber Glob. And then we start pushing G. Look at that. Look at that! Talk about a faster way of flying around. Woohoo! Alright, we hit a cold biome, which means that a night lich could be nearby, but I'm not entirely sure. We need more... Hello, anyone home? Oh, wow. There is a giant village over here. Holy macarons. It's like the one... Oh my god, there's a snowman! <laughs> Don't mind if I grab it. Thank you, sir. Look at that agility, dude. Agility's just leveling up like crazy. <laughs> Another waystone. Let's go. And compass. So the thing is with this mod pack, it's got the nature's compass, but it doesn't have the explorer's compass. Hang on a second. I think, is it the aqua captain, captain what's her face? We're going to come back here. What is this? I feel vibrations of the ice under the ice. What do you mean? To be fair, guys, I have not fought in... Oh, yeah, I okay. can't... Oh! Whoa! I can't swim in the water, guys. Remember my origin? What is that thing? Woo! Let's just... Oh, God. They weren't kidding. Oh, God. Oh! Oh, oh, oh my God. I can't fight it. Oh, a lighthouse. All right, we gotta keep flying. Oh, wait, is that a villager, like, temple thingy, Majiggy? Please, I've seen this before. Yeah, what's up, guys? I remember this. You guys always have some cool stuff around here. All right, day 54, boys. Just head home. I think we're going to just go home and uh, grab a bow. Let's go kill that nether gauntlet. Yeah, that should be good, right? Wait, what? This is a bastion. Hello and good day. Bosses of mass destruction! I I don't know how many times I've fought this guy now, man. Gotta eat a chicken? Yeah, that's what I thought, bro. You wanna mess with a guy like me? Where is this dude going? Oh. What the hell are you doing, bro? Come back down and fight me! Come down. Come back down into the arena, you dumb dumb. Come on, get close. I dare you. I dare you. Come close. Holy crap, a mole, dude. Come on. Bring it down. Yeah, right there, right there. Only a thousand left. Wow, you're just going to do that? Oh, yeah, you're dead, buddy. You're dead. You're dead. 200. Wow. Wow. Really? Really? Really, dude? Boom! This guy depleted my armor, man. Holy yikes. God dang. Only for a blazing eye. Okay, where's my where's my scrap? That chest was not worth it. That was a difficult battle. Thank you for buffing the nether gauntlet. My armor took like a massive beating, dude. Holy shit. That took a whole Minecraft day to kill that guy. We, we need mending. <laughs> we need mending so badly for this armor set. Didn't realize the durability is like pretty caca, dude. Not even gonna lie. All right, we're going to head all the way back home, try to repair the armor. Now, tell me it's Arclight Alloy that repairs the armor, man. Because now we need to get a whole new set of boots. We lost out, man. We definitely lost out. Legendary Neptonium Sword. Oh, wow. It's actually a pretty good sword, not even going to lie. All right, we got two of these guys. Oh, it is. Thank God. Thank God. Yeah, like a bunch more. Is I'm going to put my arc light armor away for now. Yeah, we might as well put on the good old jade set for now. Pink hearts. That is insane. There we go. Whoa! Take a look at that. Oh, it's this one. Here it is. Okay. I'm going to buy two skill points. I'm going to get this and get that. Maybe we can make a bloodstone sword. 
lead ore. There we go. Look how deep this cave goes, man. This is a big ass lush cave, dude. Holy shit. Look at you. Hey, buddy. Ah! What the flip is that? What is that? What is that? What is that? What is that? Ew! What the flying shit? Inventors of the shish kebab. Narwhals, narwhals swimming in the ocean. Cause of a commotion. Cause they. Oh, no! The freaking pot crap! Yeah, I'm definitely feeling that we gotta get rid of this, uh, get rid of this class, the origin, go back to human, we can go fight that other boss. I just don't know how much a a HP he's got. If the nether gauntlet's got 7,000 HP, how much HP does that freaking thing of the, uh, the ice maze, ha ice maze have? Uh, it's probably gotta be a lot, no? Let's go. Gimme, give gimme, give gimme. Give oh, wait, are those diamonds right there? Yes! Yes, it is! Yeah! Uh, we're gonna write this cave like cave three. Oh, god damn, dude. Feels good to be back home. All right. I'm gonna pick up this one, that one, that one. Yeah, we gotta figure out what we can do with runes. I have no idea, but bloodstone? Kinda looking kinda cooking right now. I think it's the same thing as the other sword, though. Yeah, it is. Yeah, because I think we're making, we're making another pair of boots, if I'm correct. Okay, it's dented. High rarity. Oh, also, thank you for not putting in, like, templates in here. You just throw it in with the ingot. Best thing ever. Make us something good. Prot 4 on breaking 3. That's the one we want. Oh, for the love of Oh, I think I see a blue ring around it. Oh, it's light dented. All right, let's try it. Yes, first try. Look at that. Cost 10 levels. Pretty expensive, but it's okay. Right there. Bang like that. Because, like, it would be pretty cool to have, like, a full set of, uh, the arc light. I mean, this sword is just really sick on its own, but cost three levels. Damn. Okay. All right, here we go. Give me... Wait, what? Doesn't have a rarity. Try again. Doesn't have a rarity. No, it doesn't have a rarity. Oh, that's not good. Right? Like this. Turn it into that. There we go. Sick. Look at that. Looking pretty snazzy now. I gotta lie. This guy right here. Oh my god, last tree. Ba -ba -da -ba. Now we can use it. Yeah, right? Yeah, look at that. It chops down so much faster too. Let's go. So since we found that boat, we gotta kill the captain that's on that boat. And uh, these towers here. These things always have tons of loot in it. Yeah, there's more gobber in here than there is netherite. There's no chest though. That's not a good thing. Not a good thing. Usually there's a bunch of chests. Uh, yeah, you see those? Is that skulls three? That's my guess, right? Diamond helmet, a cursed eye. Nice. Let's just do that. Actually, you know what? Let's set. Let's put a waystone here so it's easier to come back. Cause there is a lot of gobber. We're just gonna call it gobber. We can still get more HP. <laughs> Netherite pickaxe. Boom. What do do we need to be a certain level to use this? No, look at that. We can use it. Mining, whenever you use this, it levels up your mining by a hundred percent. Okay, so we're gonna go back into the nether and go take a look. We also need more netherite scrap. So wait, you are not skilled enough to break nether gobber ore. So what level do you have to be to break it then? Like level 50? If that's the case, I might as well go mining. I can go back into the caves and go mining again. I would need like zinc, but I don't know if I want to start collecting all this stuff. But level 49 in mining. Don't mind if I grab it. Who is that guy? Whoa! Oh, like a witch doctor? Okay, let me just kill all these guys first. Okay, I'm gonna attack this guy first then. Okay, he disappeared. I think he's summoning all the zombies. Yeah, blow up the guy. Deal some damage on him. Let's go. We killed him. What do you do? You just... Oh, and it gives us strength three for a minute all right so all these ethereal spirits oh my god i just found out something really cool then so what we need to do is keep ethereal spirits instead of throwing them out and anytime we go into a boss fight you right click the charm of strength it gives you strength three and you can use that to fight against bosses to deal more damage for about a minute straight dude that is crazy yeah let's go level 50 okay let's see if we can actually mine it now the gobber 
Yes! We can! Look at that, boys. Gobber Goblet. So, nine pieces of this gets us one ingot. We need two ingots. We gotta keep going with that. So, we have to mine this stuff here and then go to the nether and mine the stuff that's over there. We're gonna have some fun in the caves mining up some more. All right, we gotta somehow get out of this cave. Oh, wait, no, there's a crease right there. Okay, we're in luck, boys. I love the gobber mod. I added that to horror Minecraft. It was one of the best decisions I've ever done. All right, now we gotta go, please. No! Wait, why? Mine, you need level mining 55? Oh my god. Yeah, we're gonna be here a bit, dude. We need to get more levels because we're currently at mining. Le oh, I mean, we're pretty close. We only need two more levels. Plus, this, it, it also helps that this cave is pretty massive. So it's literally going up like 0.5. Yeah, that's insane. 5,000. Let's go. 55. That's what I'm talking about. There we go. Yes. It's working. Did we get it? It's not dropping. I think we need a gobber pickaxe to mine the gobber ore. So we need gobber ingots. So we need diamond, iron, and gold. You need to make a rod. You do like those two. Then you go like that. And then you get a gobber pickaxe. Common gobber pickaxe. Oh, it is. Yes. Oh my God. We got it. We got it. Got it. Okay. I'm excited. Yes. Oh my end. That is amazing. Let's go, dude. I don't know how much we need from this. I remember seeing a crap ton. Where is some more? Sharp adds an additional sharpness? I will take that. Ba 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 da ba ba. Our netherite scrap should be ready to go. All right. So what you do is you make one hole of this guy. We have enough for another gobber ingot, do we? Okay. We'll go back to the cave. Man, it's a lot of back and forth. Yes. And then, yes. Grab this, this sword, and I really hope that we get the good one. <laughs> Please roll us a really good, like, even if it's just blue, I wouldn't even mind blue. It's a common. You know what? I will take a common. Yeah, I will. I, I will take a common unless we could get another one. How do you make a rod? All right, let's go back to the nether. <laughs> let's go back to the nether and get some more. Might have to go back to the caves too again. The thing is, is that make a bunch of these. Oh, we only have two. And we can make one rod. Then another sword gives us. Yeah, let's go. <laughs> That's what I'm talking about, dude. Let's freaking go. Let's freaking go. Look how fast this thing is, too. Oh, my God. I'm not skilled enough. Wait, what? Okay, what if we raided another dungeon then? We can do that. Get some more XP, right? Or we can do a researching table, too. All right, now we're in the pink hearts, boys. There we go. This is it. Look how fast we attack, too, man. This is insane. Boom. Ooh. Oh, Rogai. Let's go. We needed that one. An ancient dart. Another one of these guys. A ball of consume and obtain plus one charm slot. So I can get hat. Dude, what if I had two heart of the golems? Oh, my God. Look at all this. If you guys are wondering, what am I doing? I am clearly just grinding for these orbs because we're, we're going to need more XP. That is for sure, because in case we get a bad sword and then we're going to need some spare XP to melange some things together. No, I blew up my orbs. Those are my orbs, man. Holy shit. Behind this block. Yep, dude, we need mending. What is that? Okay, we got to get out of here. Yeah, we're gonna go to this village over here. So we're really testing our limits here, guys. All right. We're really testing our limits. Oh, no. Oh, I'm at maximum. I'm at max, guys. Yeah, hero of Hyrule. I'm at the max. Not in here. What do we get? Demon Slayer? Uh, sharpness 4. And Demon Slayer. I don't have one breaking, but that's okay. So now what we can do. Uh, All right. So we're gonna put. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, my God. Okay, hang on, hang on. So, we're gonna completely screw over the flying dude. We need to become back into a human. So, our immunity to fire, temporary immunity to lava, burns those who attack you in melee, which is perfect. All right, so now we probably have to travel uh, far by foot in order to kill this guy, which I don't mind. Get the knife. 
not a knife. I didn't need a knife. Okay, so we make that. And then we make... Boom! We got a waste zone. So that way we can make our ways back home. We also have to pay attention to some wool. So we ever see a little, little camp or anything like that, we get the wool to make another bed. Let's grab this set of armor. We'll wear it uh, in case our... Wait, actually, no. We can wear this thing in case our armor is about to break and we'll wear this one instead. Day 68. Hey! Don't kill the freaking camels! Yeah, that's what I thought. Don't touch them. Alright, there's the ship, guys. So supposedly, you gotta raid this ship. Last time we saw it was, like, a little bit over here, right? Oh, oh, oh. what the heck, man? Echo of the ship graveyard. All aboard! Here we go. Captain of the ship is probably down there somewhere or something like that. Let's go. Where are you? I need your blood and bones. You can hear those horns, man. Oh, we got it. We got it. Oh, 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 oh. oh my God. Right. Here we go. Nothing happened. What do you mean nothing happened? Oh, do I have to do it by the water? Uh, it can be used near water. Oh, near water in the ice maze. Try again. Nothing happened. Do we have to kill the entire crew then? Yeah, let's kill your crew first. I'm going to try just on the top of the ship. Oh, it came. It's here. The ghost of Captain Carnelia. Oh, oh, oh God. Okay, hang on, hang on, hang on. Oh, there she is. She's right there. Oh, I didn't even notice. Come on. Oh, my God. Okay, hang on, hang on, hang on. Give us strength. Crack it a can. Oh, my God. I got... Oh, man. She, she like, pulls you in. Frostbite damage, dude. Yo, your regeneration is not gonna do you any good. Any good! Holy crap. Oh, frozen key opens a chest hidden in the depths of the ice maze. Where, where is that then? I've got a treasure pouch. We also have a ice maze shelter map. Oh, wait, is this what I'm, this is what we need right here? Okay, where is the frozen key? All right, I think it's more this way then. All right, here we go. Whoa, that's a weird, look at that. It's like, I heard something. Oh, it's a guardian. Wait. Oh, yeah. Oh, shit. Okay. All that wood's gonna fall. Okay, here we go. Wow, that's a big house. What is that sound? Oh, there's a big guy in there. What the frick is that? What the hell? Okay, hang on, hang on. Give me one second to process what the heck is happening. All right, let's go kill this thing. I don't know what he does, but we're going to kill it. Fight me. Oh my god, he just... Oh, he just moved. Okay. No, don't blow up my drops. He died. He dead. That was cool. Where's your front entrance, guys? I guess you guys don't have a front entrance. Well, don't mind if I... Actually, you know what? You, do, you guys do. All right, there we go. Bad omen. So if I go home with this, I'm screwed right now is what you're trying to tell me. There's something magical I hear, like a twinkle twinkle in my ear. What is this book? Entry 1. In these cursed lands, there is... There, you can't find shelter even under the ice in the thickness of the earth. Some creatures that look like eels crawled out of the depths of the underworld, depriving of its, uh, depriving uh, us of the opportunity to return back to the surface. Only the mistress of the moon knows how long shall we last. At all events, our hopes of seeing sunlight had all been, but uh, has all been vanished. This place will become our grave, our eternal tomb, for us and that damned rune. Last entry, it whispers to me, whispers inside my head, the secrets of the ice and snow, ice. Now we are chained in ice forever. I suppose- Oh my god. Okay, hang on. Uh, I suppose a familiar fate awaits the crew that set out in search of the fire rune. I maybe wonder if they made it. Oh, are you trying to say that Aquamarae will actually have like an update with a fire thing instead of ice? That's cool. The great dark forest valley through- It doesn't really matter now. That is creepy. All right, so where's this chest? Because there's a lot of pillagers I hear in this thing, man. They want to climb that wall of water. Right here. This place is like overfilled with garbage, dude. Okay, let's continue. Hello! One tapping vindicators. Shut up! Is there like a spawner in there or something? Holy shit! I, I hear it. I hear it. Don't worry. Oh, there's the chest there, right? It should be this. Oh! Woo! Rune of the storm! Look at that! 
Just grab it all. Attaches to the sword in your offhand, increasing the, its damage in cold biomes by 33%. Holy frig. All right, so I think that thing that we're looking at over there is a fairy and somehow a golden moth in a jar. Did we like free you guys or something? I think we did our part. We found the legendary chest. Yeah, we're gonna start by going up the big old cold stairs. We're already up to a good start. There we go. Here he, here he. On the lands of the Aquamarine mod, we have slain the captain. Cornelia, slain the gigantic worm that dwells in the caves of the lost town of whatever we just raided. I'm gonna call this one Ice Maze. <clears throat> that I know of. And we're gonna try to get mending on the villager because we need that mending book, man. Real bad. I like to keep this armor long haul. <laughs> Unless we try to go for something cooler. Go out and kill some more withers or something. Alright, where are these guys again? Here they are. Hello, guys. Whoa! Oh, there's a zombie. Two zombie villagers in the in the well, just like uh, that one scene in The Walking Dead. Come on, big boys. Leave my villagers alone. Wappa! Wappa! Yeah, party! I got villagers in a horn and a hole. Chicken in the corn, so the corn can't grow. Mama, chicken in the corn, so the corn can't grow. Mama, hee hee, chicken in the corn, so the corn can't grow. Attaches to the sword in your offhand. Oh, so you put that in your offhand and then it's like, ooh, look at me, I'm strong, I'm big and strong. I have the power to like wield. Look at me, all big and strong. I'm so big and strong. <laughs> Chicken in the corn corn. So the corn can grow corn. Because yeah. like we were trying to find a coal biome so we can at least fight the night lich. It would be so good if we could. Ooh, level 37. Uh, oh my god. <laughs> you make another shield. So you can just make like until you get a legendary shield. Oh, that's like a broken... So you take two of these guys, make it like that. Oh my god! <laughs> Let's go! You put it on, and it's gonna give you more armor, more luck, and more attack damage. Insane. Absolutely mind-boggling. Wait, since we have Hero the Village, do you think he will give me the mending? Do you think you'll finally give me mending after the bajillion times I'm trying to do this? I have Hero the- I saved your village twice. Please give me mending! Efficiency five. God damn. Damn it. Okay, I'm going. I'm switching. I don't care anymore. I'm switching. Yeah, no, you suck. You suck. There's two other villagers that are stuck in a hole in which I'm gonna help. Sharpshooter. Oh shit. No, 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 no. Chicken in the corn. Some the corn can't grow. Ceaseless can shoot basic arrows without consuming ammunition. That's it. That's it, guys. I'm serious. I'm serious. Yeah, I'm serious. Yeah. Guys are useless pieces of poop. Don't want to give me mending. You're making me spend levels on my freaking armor. Oh, I have to copper right there. Oh, look at that. We already got some there. Ding, ding, ding. Nice. Don't worry, Mumu. I'm going to get you out of there. Come on, buddy. Come on, little buddy. It sounds like a bunch of molasses coming out of my mouth. Get in there. Join up with the villagers and you're going to stay in there until I say so. <laughs> you ain't going to be coming out of that thing for a little while. There we go. Boom, like that. There you go. And then now we're going to go and uh, try to lay out something. Because I like this open concept that I have. I don't know if I want to copy that same layout, but I mean, why not, right? Like, it, does, it doesn't really hurt to, like, make it kind of look the same. Perfect. You guys are going to get milked. <laughs> hey, look, a baby. Moo. 
I, I always keep forgetting. So this drink I'm drinking is called Sparkling Ice, okay? It says it's sweetened with sucralose. I have no idea what the difference, because I know what, like, fruit, 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 to fruit to los? Hang on. I'm opening Opera GX. Also, Opera GX, sponsor me if you want, okay? I use your service all the time. I use your browser. It, okay, what is the difference between sucralose and glucose? Or sucrose and sucralose. Yeah, here we go. Uh, while sucrose is a natural sugar, sucralose is made artificially. Okay, so, so this drink is artificial sweeteners. Oh, that's sucky. Yeah, so it's zero sugar. That is so weird. Why is it done like that? But we're moving the sugar label on the nutritional facts because technically it's not real sugar. Am I wrong on this? Like, I, I'm not entirely, I don't know how this science works, okay? But I'm not, let's look at this. So what, the difference between sucrose and sucralose, okay, so oh sucrose versus sucralose. Oh, sucrose is naturally occurring sugars, commonly known as table sugars. So like the sugar that you like wake up in the morning, you're like, oh shit, gotta add my big ass spoon of sugar in my goddamn coffee. And then sucralose on the other hand is an artificial sweetener produced in a lab is su let's look at this okay here it is is sucralose still sugar sucralose is a unique among artificial sweeteners because it is made from real sugar a chemical process tweaks it in chemical structure making it 600 times sweeter than sugar that is insane to the nutritional facts on bottles of what you're drinking that have sucralose to determine how many grams of sucralose is actually inside of it right I mean, it is calorie free, so I don't, know, I don't see why you want to like, you know, zero, zero calories with sugars, but sucralose, how much to see like they're putting in there? Because look, if it's 600 times sweeter than actual sugar, then how, what is the ratio? It like, say like you put, you know, like a, a, okay, okay. Like a bottle of Mountain Dew. Do you guys know how much sugar that shit has? It's got like 68 grams of sugar or 70 grams of sugar in like that entire bottle. An entire bottle of Mountain Dew, right? Now, to get it that sweet and you drink an entire bottle of that much sugar is actually insane. So, removing that sugar and putting sucralose, my guess is that you only would need to put like, what, 8 to 10 grams of sucralose? Oh my god, there's like a little... Like, 8 to 10 grams of sucralose? Like, why can't you extract fructulose, right, out of fruits and add that into drinks? I mean, I'm, it's probably what's in apple juice because, like, that's what it is. And, like, orange juice. But, like, instead of, like, artificially making flavors like this, like this sparkling ice, it's, like, cherry limeade, but it's artificially made flavors. Why don't they just take fructulose? out of like the sugars in it and then just put natural flavored sugars out of table sugars instead of drinks to just make them sweeter with the artificial flavors i don't know big brain idea maybe i'm just thinking too much now oh my god my brain my oh hoo, 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 i'm cooking wait why do i have a raid oh i killed those guys i gotta kill i gotta do another raid are you kidding me oh here he is victory yay let's go Oh, we could go to the Twilight Forest. We haven't been there in a hot minute. Oh, yeah. Dude, we can fight some bosses in there. There's a lot of those guys we can do in there, too. Boop. We're great farmers now, boys. There we go. Look at us go. Okay. Okay, here we go. All right, here we go. I'm gonna grab six just in case and head all the way back home so we can make another waystone. There we go. To the freaking Twilight Forest again. I know you gotta make like a hole and you need like a poppy. So I gotta look this up again. Okay, should work. Yep, it did. Oh man, this is a classic right here, boys. All right, who's ready? One, two, one, two, three, four. We're in the twilight forest, boys. Oh, man, there's already a big structure there. Oh, no way. The Yeti's going to be over here, too. Though I forget how the order is. We have to fight the, uh, the snake-looking guy first, right? All right, what is this? Oh, wait, no way. We get to fight it now? No way. It's not blocked off. I thought it would have been blocked off for us. That's kind of strange. I'm not even going to lie, guys. Oh, no, it is blocked off. Let's go. 
Ba 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 ba! Man, we should get our own theme song. You know, get it composed by someone. Every time we do an intro on these videos, we get like a our own theme song. I don't know about you guys, but I've been playing a frick ton of Hell Divers too. And honestly, like, I I'm not sure if clans is actually going to become a thing. But if it does, friend PK and I, PK is going to start a clan. I'm going to join it, and we're going to cause lots of democracy inside of the lands. You guys are more than welcome. Oh, hang on. All right, there's one. That was so easy. They should buff it. Wait, was that it? Gear can you make out of that? I think it's just the chest plate and pants. Yes, yeah, so we need. We have nine pieces. But yeah, I've been pretty addicted to that game. If you guys want to see content of that, I have a really good idea for a video for it. It's just I think it's going to take a long time to do. Um, If you guys are really interested in that kind of concept. Let me know. Let me know. If any of you guys play Helldivers, join our Discord. Uh, I am more than open to dive with you guys at any time whenever I'm playing. I typically play at night, so I have a... Uh, we have an open slot you guys are invited to play we need a big clan we need to you know liberate a bunch of planets and, and do our parts you know yes yeah there we go just die dude just die just death just death okay let's go night lich okay there we go oh that one was gonna be a hurt one anyways let's go Let's go, man. I don't want the gold plates. So I'll take those. The Lich Trophy. And you have the Scepter of Fortification. Nine charges? Only nine charges? Wait, Scepter of Fortification. Wait, does that give me extra health? All right, let's get out of here. Uh, what the heck? Why is there just random sandstone like that right there, dude? That's weird. I want them scales. Make me a chest plate. Make me a pantaloons. That's a big ass tree, dude. Holy. But it just won't do anything. Because it's always nighttime here. Interesting, right? A bang, 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 bang! Oh, a dungeon bag. Look at that. That's cool. And it's purple. I don't have low effect. Oh. Oh, here we go. There's a lot of guys in here. Let's go, baby boys. These guys are. Oh. Oh, yeah. There's so many in here. Oh, yeah. Here's the Alpha Yeti. Oh, my God. Okay. Okay. All right. Um. Yeah. Okay. Uh. Deer. Deer. Orange juice. Uh. You gotta. You gotta buff. You gotta buff these bosses, bro. If you're gonna make the Nether Gauntlet have seven thousand HP, but only make the Alpha Yeti have two hundred, man, you got a lot of work you gotta do, man. Well, this is all free XP basically, so I'm just gonna farm all these guys. try to break this it won't allow me right yeah okay yeah it's not gonna allow me that's so weird Ooh, I got a little maze chest hostile wolf ah! bug stomper what is that character in the middle is that that's me right like flying on the floor like lying down on the ground we're gonna go home I think we're going to start exploring up this way as well. We want to find the Night Lich. So we do want to enter some in colder biomes. But I might want to go back into the ice maze. <laughs> I told it to OJ, dude. He responded already. And he was like, oh, only 200? Yeah, that needs to be a lot higher. I'm like, yeah, I basically one tapped it. I think I like, hit it like three times with my sword and I already died. That thing like died instantly. The Naga was like, what, two, three hits? Alpha it was like, I don't know, maybe four. 200 HP, so... What? You, you, you think this is some sort of game? Ow. Jesus Christ. Okay, I fell on the floor. It's not my fault, man. Hey. What? I just thought of something super sick. It's going to be like the craziest, deadliest freaking video of all time. Dude, I just thought of it. I ain't going to tell you. I ain't going to tell you. You're just going to have to stick with it. What is that? Oh, okay. Oh, it's a little graveyard. Okay, that's cool. What is that thing, dude? Waystone! Do -do -do -do! Big ship here. That is so odd. 
Dude, I've been, I've been collecting these waystones for a while. Why am I just getting to this now? Oh, yeah. If you guys are interested in any, like, sort of, like, anime-inspired mod packs, let me know on that as well. Uh, I, I, I would, I, I don't watch a lot of anime recently, but I could watch the show and then play the packs after, okay? The only one, the only packs that I don't want to do is something that's like One Piece, you know, I, give me, give me a show that's, that's good and, and I can watch it in like, I don't know, a week, you know, you know what I'm saying? Okay, here we go. Yeah, that seems to have a lot better performance. Well, this is pretty though. Look at this. It is pretty. What is that place? Oh, wait, is that that llama thingy majiggy? I think so. Yeah, it looks like it. I'll go take a look either way, but if it's that llama thingy majiggy, I want to go back. Yeah, it looks like it's made out of wool. Look at that boat. Oh, God. Okay, it's a little rundown. Yeah, I think that's what that llama thingy is. There's this structure. There's that structure. There's a gigantic uh, villaggio. That thing is freaking sweet. Yeah, witch hazel. Yep. Yeah, that looks like the bewitchment. Hang on. X-ray. Oh, no, it's not. It's X-ray. Surfing bird. <laughs> There we go. Traveling out in the what? We want that. Break, break. <laughs> what is this? Seems like there's a small little village over here too. We got a tiny one. Yeah, I think I just might head back to the house. And you know what? I might just work on every tier inside of that quest line. Like turns of building, the crafting, and maybe do a bit of fishing. We'll do it all. You know, we'll get all these quests done. Because I'm sure he puts a lot of time and effort for these quests to be completed. So that's why, like, I'm, I, I like it. If I was, if it was for me, you know? And then maybe we come here. Look, it's a beach. We got a giant palm tree. We can make a vacation home. Oh my god. That's not super beachy, you know? Oh, it's another witch place. Far. One endurance level. We got all that stuff. We grab this, we put that there, uh, grab that, uh, we put that there, uh, and then we have looting too. Look at that. Gotta put this painting right there. Look at that. He's gorgeous. Medieval paintings. Hello, my friend. How are you? Oh, you can make a blue bed, but white is, no, white is gonna be alright. Um, now we're gonna grab this. Grab my crafting table. Put the crafting table down. Make a bed. And now we have bed. Place your bed. It's three torches at the top, two logs in the middle, diamond, diamond, gold, gold. Mega torch. So what does this thing do precisely? Like if you place it down, do, I, I'm sure it like emits light everywhere, right? So let's see, let's make like a little post here like that. It's just a giant torch. I need an axe to break it. Okay, it's just a, it's just a big torch. <laughs> okay. All hail Mega Torch. All hail. <laughs> yeah, we're gonna go with this. One max health with a shield in hand. So we get a whole ass heart. So here's what I'm thinking, guys, is that, well, look, okay. We got, we got the armor, right? We got a pre-built house, right? Pre-built. It, it, it's, it's, it's not the greatest looking thing. We have a lot of grass. We have a broken house, a barn, a chest area. So here's what I'm thinking is that we will actually decorate. Oh, ho, ho, ho. you guys are thinking like, well, Kevin, that's not typically what you do. Normally, I see you go out, explore, raid a dungeon, kill some bosses well you know what we're gonna do something different all right we're, we're gonna spice things up in our life we're gonna make this place look really pretty uh, my god i can't talk really pretty so you might guys remember that sand i found um that pretty looking sand where is it oh yeah here it is all the way over here at a beach or something yeah it was over here right no oh my god dude we went far holy shit it was like over here so we're going to get rid of this, all of it right now. Okay, so this is where all that sand's going to go. And then go down this way. Oh shit, yeah, there's the Twilight Forest portal. I forgot. 100 days of like farming. What, like a farming pack? We become like a farmer. That'd be cool, like a cozy vibe. Oh dude, I can definitely do one of those. That would be so much fun. 
Oh, that is amazing. Look at that. Pink. Woohoo! Blue sand. Look at that. Like a design just like randomized, you know? This is hilarious. You can kind of see it though. Look. Very great. Look, you can kind of see it. Looks pretty nice. There you go. You know what? We could get a palm tree. Dude, a palm tree would look so freaking cool. Oh, it's not medieval, but who gives a shit? <laughs> you know? Where's the farm? Alright, there is a palm tree over here that we can grab. See if we can get these saplings for it. Good morning! Go home. Go like here, like this. And there you go! So now to kind of make it look like it's realistically like sitting on the water. So what I was thinking is that you mix the oak. <laughs> Hello? It's off by one, so you can make like the door like right there to, en to enter in. It's funky. It's definitely funky. I've never built something like this before, so. Go like that window like right there would be pretty cool. It, it, it looks really good so far though. Like, you gotta admit, look, we're cooking. We're cooking. All right, days 91, ladies and gents. Days 91, we're getting closer and closer and closer. I don't know, uh, I don't know if you guys know him or not, but uh, back in the summer, I'd say about July, like, you know what? It was actually the day after I posted Fantasy Minecraft, like my old video in August. And whenever I uh, watched, uh, not whenever I posted, the day after, I got a recommendation on YouTube um, to watch this video. And it was a guy named Glorb, and it was a song called Eugene. So basically, it's this guy who does AI work with the SpongeBob universe universe with like spongebob characters and stuff and it is so freaking good and I, I i shit you not like it so it was so freaking good i was surprised i was like oh my god this guy could actually rap really well like what the heck like what am i even watching right now because you would you, you're you're going into it like oh my god it's gonna be a massive meme which it is but at the same time the production level of the stuff is phenomenal i i like for me because i listen i listen to a lot of rap music i don't know about you guys but i listen to a lot of rap music and like a lot of like punk rock and like thrashy skater music that's like typically what i listen to and a lot of hard style like electronic edm and drum and bass anyways the industry for the rap scene this guy does pulls off the ai beats and produces his music and lyricism that he's gotten his like songs are absolutely insane like he's very very talented and like it, it, it's crazy so i've been following this guy since the summer and i think moist yeah it was moist critical did a video about uh about his channel which was really cool because like oh my god i was like oh my god dude i follow this guy like there's no way i was figuring it out like he's got a bunch of lore that goes on with the series as well he's faceless and the thing is is that i have a feeling i have a theory that this guy is definitely no 100 percent a freaking ghost writer for a lot of popular like uh i don't know like a lot of popular artists that are out there like i'm sure he produces music for a lot of different artists that are out there i'm sure he writes a lot of lyrics for a lot of artists out there and my guess okay my theory what i've cooked up in my brain is that Glorb seems to be wanting to succeed in the music industry. Oh, oh god, I pushed I pushed the pushed the wrong button. He wanted to succeed in the music industry, but he was embarrassed of how he talks, essentially. So that is that is my giant theory. It's a long stretch. Extremely long stretch, okay? Don't cancel me. But it is it is a theory. It is a theory. And I have a really good feeling, and that's what it is. And if that's what it is, man, dude, either way, like, he is so talented at what he does. It is actually insane. But yeah, I think this is looking pretty well. Okay, so now we need to go get some actual sand. There we go. You put, like, a cabinet there, and it gives it some texturized kind of thing. So you can open the cabinet, and we're at, you can put some shit in there. So, like, this apple and this pink dif daffodil. Who, who is underneath there? What are you doing? Is there a wandering trader underneath my base right now? What are you doing? You're asking for it. 
Now there's just carcasses spinning around in circles like a Beyblade. Oh, it grew! Look at that! It's the red one! With the funky design on the tree trunk. That's cool. Hmm. I'm learning, guys. I'm learning. So then you put an actual full block. Looking pretty snazzy in here. I kind of like it. But this needs to be moved. It is a spinning blade of mayhem. So I think I might just throw it on top of that thing to kind of just tuck it in the corner. It makes it look like it's cutting the wood. Okay, so let's get to work. What a unique flavor. I gained two hearts? I, I, I actually want to talk to you guys about something else that I've been hyper obsessed with a lot lately. I don't know if you guys remember the days and age of like being in uh, YouTube in like the early 2000s. Like, well, I say mid 2000s. So like we're talking like the song came out a little bit later, but um, we're thinking I would say roughly 2008 YouTube. Okay, so or even 2007. We'll, we'll say 2007, 2008 all the way till 2010 you're you're scrolling through youtube and uh you're looking up a tutorial uh on how to install anything that you're wanting so sometimes like there was a lot of videos out there that were do you know how to install a cracked version of minecraft or how to get minecraft for free or how to get cracked photoshop or um, how to uh, install uh, Roblox or, you know, all that kind of fun jazzy stuff. There was this just one song that would always play. Everyone was using it for every single tutorial and it was always the same format. It was always the guy opening up Notepad on his computer and then typing, hey guys, Thanks for coming to my video. Today I'm going to be showing you how to do so and so and so and so. And uh, I found it to be so nostalgic. But the song that was used, okay, I would have never thought that I would be listening to this guy's album from whenever he released the song to this day a frick ton of times because it's actually good. <laughs> I like it and I have no I have no idea why I like it so much I just I just do you guys may not know what song I'm talking about but I can probably play it really quick on the the, the YouTube video or uh, yeah so it the song is called it's by 009 sound systems I know that for a fact I think it's called dreamscape you just hear this Anyways, you get my gist, right? You hear that song, and I don't know, the, the, it just the song makes you feel odd. Is it just me? It makes it feel like you're on like the creepy YouTube side of, like the creepy side of YouTube with those tutorial videos of like showing you how to do stuff. But that song just made it feel odd. It's just a bit odd. Like you're you're in some creepy pasta zone, but you're not in the creepy pasta zone. Eh, a bit normal, but honestly, I don't think I need this cave anymore. I think I'm just going to cover this up. Little cute little thingy majiggy. And then we're going to make some lanterns. Oh, yeah. Okay, that's cool. I like that. No. Yeah, I like that. That is nice. I don't want the big one. Whoa, look at that. What the heck? Alpha Yeti Nanaga. <laughs> that's cool. Yeah, okay. There you go. That looks good. Lantern here. Right here. Yeah, man. And people say I can't build. Look at that. I, I just winged it. You just go for a nice wing. Sometimes, like, you make a really poopy house. I'm not the greatest builder. Keep that in mind. But I can build some nice things sometimes. Sometimes. The area, compared from what it was looking like before, you have to admit this is a lot better than what it was like. And now that we actually have an actual house that we probably don't want to live in there anymore, that is our official little beach house. You know, you get some sunshade, so if you like you got too much sun, you can just come sit down. Have a seat underneath the shade. Get some shade so you don't get a sunburn. You know, you just have a nice little lie down. What you do is you do bang, 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 bang. Close them all up like that. Just like this. So it gives it some texture. Yeah, you see how it goes like this? Like this guy over here, dude. He is the most inconsiderate bozo I've ever met in my entire life. And you suck. You suck. I might just kill you. Honestly. 
<laughs> oh yeah, I love this design. A fence gate makes it like look like it's a, a opening window from the outside. It's sick. We're on a time crunch now, and there is still a lot of stuff that I still want to do. So I think we might just go and try to find the Night Lich Tower. I don't know where to go look for it, to be quite frank. I have no idea. Thank you so much. Thank you for doing business. I think three stacks of arrows should be enough. If not, we can always just come back. Where's your job, though? What the frick? Hey! Don't do that, man. That is not nice. All right. What is this? Joining world. Oh. World. Oh, God. It's all the way out here. Okay. So, not that one. Cave? Maybe it's cave? Oh, it is cave. Sick. Um, if you don't mind, I'm going to take the waystone now. I take it with me, so that way I can make it back home. But we got to dig out of here. All right, now onto the waters we go. Whoa! The leopard shark, right? What the hell? Whoa! All I had to do was come out here and you see all this cool shit? Whoa! Okay, so that's what that was. Dude, look at that! Hang on a second. Gotta get rid of all this, because Rainbow Beach is all annoying with these freaking points. Whoa, look at this! Wow. Wow, this place is awesome. Oh yeah, it's a piglin brew thingy. This forest is magnificent. Look at this. Yeah, another jungle, it said, right? Okay, it was only a small jungle. I want to kind of swim out this way. Yeah, I kind of do. Let's go this way. I'd like to see this. Ouch. Please don't tell me that's another ice maze. Oh, I think it is. It is a frozen ocean here. So we got deep cold ocean to frozen ocean. <laughs> it was right there. So it is in the ice maze. And there's the polar bears. Look at that. Dude, this makes me actually really happy. This is like, I don't know about you guys, but the uh, returning knight and the night lich are some of my favorites. Freaking boss fights in this, like inside of this mod. Is that the second floor? Oh, what is the second floor? Oh, and there's a spawner here, dude. Okay, it's fine. All right, so let's get their shield out. Boom. All right. All right, here we go. All right, now it's dark. So now what we can do is we do the true sight. Here we go. There we go. Oh, God. All right, where's the night lich at, though? Oh, there he is. Hello. Oh, he's a... F oh, did they buff his speed? Hit him twice? Oh my god, they have to buff his health. They really gotta... Oh! Okay, they buffed the damage, though. That's for sure. Is he pissed off at the anglerfish? <laughs> Infant... I hate these phantoms. Frick off, dude! Two. Whoa! Come on, come back, come back! Oh, nice shot. Give me health boost. Yes! Woohoo! Watch. Watch him have mending. Watch him have mending on him. That's going to be hilarious if he does. Watch him have mending. All right, I think that's everything. The polar bear can't swim. Come on, buddy. I'm sleeping. Screw all of you guys. All of you. All right, day 99, boys. Well, aka day 100. Dude, I would have, like, two-tapped the night lich with my sword. Honestly, that would have been like the easiest shit of my life. All right, let's see what kind of loot we got. Oh my God, wait, hang on. We can fight Captain Cornelia again, but this time we're going to add Sweeping Zedge and Vitality 3. I hope we have enough XP for it, but look, man, there's a lot of those guys camping out there. Okay, so we're going to go back to the ship, kill the guy with the horn, summon Captain Cornelia again, and let's just see how much damage we can deal to her. Put this down. We're going to name this uh, Captain Boss Lady. Here we go. Oh, here they are. So is that not the ship then? I was kind of hoping I would be able to find another one, but I, I was so sure that this is the ship. All right, we're going to just go take a look. I heard the horn going from this direction. I don't know if it is that ship, unless we have to loot the ship that has the thing in it, but I don't know. That could be it. Honestly, I don't know if it's like different for other ones. 
the hell do you get up to these other levels, bro? Oh, some diamonds in here. That's cool, at least. Okay, and we got the top of the little sighting thingy, Majiggy. All right, let's head home. Cozy up by a campfire. Oh, man. Okay, now we got a lot of stuff. All right, so here's what I'm thinking. I know it's a bit dangerous. It may not make seem to make sense, but what if we placed the campfire at our beach house on the deck? Sit down on our porch, you know? We're gonna put, like, the fire, like... Like right here ah that's nice take off that have a nice little seat and enjoy ourselves and guys thank you so much for watching this entire journey of the 100 days of surviving through strictly medieval minecraft i also would like to in uh to the to thank orange juice for inviting me to play the such an amazing pack I, I, I think I'm going to do a new, new segment every time I do a, uh, a whole new pack every time. So I'm going to start it now. My rating of the entire pack all together after putting in many hours, spending 100 days. I think it's fair enough to say that I can have a good little judgment about how the pack is. And I'm going to scale it from 1 to 10 hamburgers. Has a lot of potential. And I guess it's just from my spawning area. Doesn't have many structures. Just tend to have a lot of biomes. So it's safe to say that Strictly Medieval Minecraft gets a solid... There's still lots of work that needs to be put into this pack. A lot of bug fixes and um, a lot of rarity systems. So like, you know, whenever I make uh, these arc light shovel and epic paladin sets, they still need to get the tiers on them, which I know it's a quick fix probably. Also, I feel like there is not many origins to pick from. You, get, you need a lot more origins to pick from because I know there's a lot of people like to roleplay. Uh, you need a little bit more magic in the in the mod pack, but I know you're trying to stick with a little bit of medieval, which I kind of get. And a lot of like um, uh, HP fixes on some of the bosses because look, man, all you need to get is this nether gobber sword. And with 15.5 attack damage, what you get sharpness for with all these freaking crazy enchants. And you see how fast you can kill stuff. Because some of this stuff, like, whenever you have, like, uh, uh, bonuses and stuff like that, um, uh, whenever you wear armor for, like, the rarity that it is, you can get pretty broken, especially whenever you want to spend lots of levels in the side of the skill tree. So you can buy a skill point and then make more. I only, I only did this. And you see how broken I am? So there needs to be some sort of balance between a lot of the stuff that's being played inside of the mod pack. Um, third thing is that the quests. Um... It, it seems nice, but the thing is, is that it doesn't really tell like a story. So you kind of need a little system that tells you a story. I kind of like that. So all you see is like medieval time, the beginning, basic crafting. It kind of seems like you just, every mod that has, that is added to this pack just gets its own quest line. So I want to see like... Uh, a, a system like of chapters that you can complete you know like instead of like going into like bosses like fight all the bosses of mass destruction all the mousy's bosses like i want to see like a thing where you have to go fight this boss first and like the meaning why you want to go fight that boss and then go to the next one so like you can mix the both of them you know you can say like go fight go and find the night lich once you find the night lich and kill it which i can re redeem i get a pickaxe of reversion and stuff like that uh, you can go fight, like, I don't know, like, the Mousies, like, uh, find the lair of the Forgotten Knight and get rewarded for that. And, like, the reason why you go to the Night Lich and then the Forgotten Knight is because, like, well, look, I don't know, some, some lore or something like that. Because it just seems like you just threw a bunch of, kind of, the uh, quests that are inside of here, which I, I'm sure you took a long time to make. But these are cool. I like this. Not so much of this not so much of this i like the rewards the rewards are really overpowered in terms of some of the stuff that you can do especially with this combat training stuff uh, i basically got a free netherite sword and an entire block of uh of netherite from doing one of these quests and that's how i got all my netherite basically which was a little bit broken to me because look i was able to make this armor what was it like day 20 or day 30 or something like that i don't remember like that's pretty early for this kind of armor i'm not gonna lie that's pretty early but anyways uh, that is my that is my feedback on uh, the mod pack. 
I love the RuneScape value of it. I love the aspect of like the PMMO that's in here, and uh, you have to you have to be a specific level to wear certain things and to use certain equipment. And I'm a big fan of that, by the way. A lot of mod pack players out there use this system. PMMO is like absolutely amazing. I'm a big fan of it. Uh, it, 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 it locks your progression. Just make a good, make sure you make a good balance. Okay, that's all I ask. Anyways, thanks so much for watching. We'll see you guys next time. Bye. Peace.